Good morning, good morning, la 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 la. Good morning, good morning to you and you and you and you, fabulous Janet. Hiya. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> morning. Bit of a frog. Uh, it's been a little bit of a. It's been a bit of a hectic morning. It has. It has. We have got a law-abiding citizen in the building today, otherwise known as Laura Binding, who is doing her workshop. Everyone's just starting to arrive there, and uh, 20 minutes ago, in fact, 15 minutes ago. We were filming a DVD, so it's been one of those mornings again. Uh, I've decided to go for a Shakespearean male ballerina look today. Looking I feel good. like I should be wearing some tight jog for tight leggings with this. Uh, it's me, Shakespearean ballerina male look. What are you thinking, Mike? Would you like to wear this top? I don't know if I could pull that off. You don't know if you could pull it off? I tell you what, should we have a Mike's moment throughout the show today? Shall we? <laughs> Kim just said, oh, yeah, let's do it. Uh, Mike, you are able to select a product today, or Kim might tell you which one. We'll have a Mike's moment later on in the show where you can present a piece of jewellery. Are you excited? Yeah, I could do these. You could do the what, what? Why do you want to do that one? I know, it's easy. <laughs> He's chosen a product he thinks will be really, He's really like easy. tell people about it, you know, like... And if you, do you know what? Why don't you discuss which product you would like to present with Kim? I won't have anything to do with it, and we'll see that later in the show, and I'm, I'm excited. Are you excited? I'm sure you are. Thank you so much for joining us today. Now, we have got what an amazing show, very different feel to today's show, because we're gonna be doing a lot of amazing deals on findings. We've got some incredible gemstones along the way as well, but also changing things up slightly, because you know our guest designers usually get three kits? Well, that's not exactly happened today. Janet's actually had two kits to prepare for us and then a matrix box. How cool is that? So we're going to see a matrix box set up and in action. Also, a big focus on today's show will be crocheting and wow. I know I shouldn't talk about stealing because that's naughty, but yeah. I am stealing that closest one, the pink one. I've got to have that in my life today. Love it, love it, love it. So we've got lots and lots and lots of things going on today's show, but also we've got some knitting tools in today's show. Um, we've got a, this, this tool here, which effectively, you can create something that's almost like a cross between a kumihimo, crocheting, and knitting. So this is a braiding tool that will be featured in today's show. I've actually got two different varieties, so I'm intrigued. I'm, this is a new tool to me. Might not be new to you, it's new to me, so I'm excited about that. And um, we've also got incredible aquamarine going to the pr most ridiculous price. I've got completely, totally and utterly natural, amazing ruby going dramatically um, lower than it should be. I have this emerald here, which was just being photographed and then I um, just placed it here and I just think it's the most beautiful emerald. It's natural and it's Brazilian. Look at this. coming up a little bit later. That is genuine Brazilian emerald. You could not be besting that at a better time because of course it's May's birthstone. But right now, should we do the early bird? Okay, um, Mike, could you possibly pass me a blackboard, silver play? Thank you. Um, we're looking at 925 sterling silver findings. But a mixture of gold and silver. Thank you, darling. Okay, so when you get um, when you get your gemstone chance of distinction, sometimes, and I'm talking about gemstone chance of distinction because if you've got a high quality gemstone and you want it to go a bit further, it's quite nice just to use a little spacer bead. Well, you don't really necessarily want to be using. Obviously, it's personal choice. A copper or a different base metal. For me, if I'm going to use a genuine gemstone strand of distinction, I want to use 925 sterling silver. So we've got a wicked offer, a wicked offer for your early bird. Oh my goodness, it's gonna be amazing. You need to dial quickly. Now, you're going to be getting, what did you just say, sorry Kim? Seven and a half grams of 925 sterling silver. Have a look at these. So first off, you're gonna get two different sizes of the beads themselves. Oh. I just adore those. I absolutely adore those. A hundred, in fact, is that right? A hundred of these? Yeah. A hundred of the little dinky ones. Now, can you imagine those interspersed with, between the emeralds? 
Now, obviously, you can think about using these with the bead loom, couldn't you? Coming up tomorrow morning, bead loom back in stock. And also, you can put beads through the tool that we have in today's show. You can actually put beads attached onto your cords to go through because it's sizable holes. So that's something else to think about. Now, these are absolutely gorgeous. Um, they're a really, really good size hole. You're going to be able to get loads of different types of threads through those. Really good size hole. In fact, let me get one of these out of the pack for you. They're already going, folks. If you know, you can trust us. Oh, where's my tweezers? I can't find my tweezers. Where are my tweezers? Where are my tweezers? Where have they gone? Andrew Lloyd Webber, if you are watching, I am no longer doing musicals. I'm here. Yes, here we go. Right. Did you like my brief little sung interlude? Okay, these are flying out. Can you see the size hole there? If I do that, can you see? Oh. I have no idea where that just went. Oh, did it go there? Oh, did it go all the way over there? Yes. Wow. And look, because it's 90... Oh, that doesn't actually want to stay here, does it? Um, right, big, 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 big size hole on that one. I will be able to show you in a moment. Okay, we've got lots and lots and lots of you multi-buying. So you get those as well. You get 40 of those. This is, these are flying out. Now this... This, 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 this is the exact type of bead that a big, 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 big um, known company use a black cord with and just put probably 20 of these in a full bracelet, maybe 22 on the extended chain as well with black satin cord and charge an absolute fortune. Um, you're going to love them because these are actually more donut shape. Can you see that? Again, you're able to get... Oh, Goodness sake, Lucy. Have I got different tweezers? They're different tweezers. Yeah. They're different tweezers. I'm going to blame Mike because he, he got me these tweezers. It's his fault. Okay, almost half the stock has already gone on these. Goodness. Okay, so and these ones are four by two millimeters. Um, you have got four millimeters on the gold balls, two millimeters on the hundred, um, on the small one. Sorry, two, yeah. Get together, Lucy. A hundred two millimeter gold plated 95 stone silver balls, 40 four mil gold plated 95 stone silver balls, and 40 95 stone silver rondelles at four by two millimeters. Now, these are rondelles, rondelles. Um, we just got loads to do, which is why I'm a bit ma. Okay, are you ready? It should be £21.85, pence, which is already incredibly competitive at £21.95. Now, the whole point of the early bird is to entice you to start shopping, to open your order, because once you've started ordering, you're paying your post and packaging price. Now, that post and packaging, £2.95, you only pay... How many times do you pay that post and packaging in a day, Mike? It's, um, it's only one price. Just once. You know, it doesn't matter how much you order. Doesn't matter how much you order. No. Really, you only pay two ninety five once all day. Yeah, all day. All day. Yeah. That's amazing. Mike's going to be presenting a piece of, uh, well, a product for you later in the show. Okay, are you ready? So usual price is twenty one eighty five. Good luck, everyone. It's on a first come first serve basis. Over half the stock's gone. We're at fourteen ninety five, but it's literally your show price. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five. There's one hundred and eighty beads there, and if you are ah. Uh, Absolutely flying out. Thank you for joining us this morning. We are busy, busy, busy already. Um, for those of you who are buying more than one of those at a time, that's very sensical shopping. Lots of sensical shopping taking place there. They're just so useful, aren't they, Janet? That, they're amazing. And at that price, that, that's really, really good. But they're a great size, great as a, as a spacer bead. Um, and, and with your sort of your higher end gemstones, the sterling silver, it's fabulous. With those emeralds, perhaps, in, in mm, yeah. those. What gorgeous. size do you think you'd use with the emeralds, the smaller ones or these ones? Um, probably the smaller ones. Yeah. Just so that the emeralds sort of, you know. Ping. Yeah, yeah. Oh, gorgeous. yeah. Oh, yeah. 14 at 95, right. How many are left, sorry, hun? We've only got 30 packs left. Get confirming. And now, if you've got this in your uh, basket, if you're shopping on the website, you do need to check out your basket immediately because we've got a lot more people joining us on the phone lines if you try to get them at nine o'clock tomorrow morning if there's any left 21.85 why would you do that 14 pounds and 95 pence 
Okay, we're going to go over to Janet in just a moment and see her challenge. And I do really, really want to apologise, a public apology um, on TV to all of my team here today. Because I, you know, I'm doing this, let's get really healthy, let's train for a half marathon for charity. Oh my goodness, what am I doing? I've had smoked salmon and boiled eggs in here this morning. It smells a bit like drain. Could you not smell it? Oh, the smells made me feel sick and I've eaten it. <laughs> it smells like drain. Not attractive. Anyway, that's a really nice thought for you, isn't it? Thank you very much for your messages uh, yesterday as well. Um, thank you for joining me. I'm also with you tomorrow. But right now, we are going to set Janet an amazing challenge because the kit has actually got masses of organza ribbon in it as well as lots of other Ujimar flip flop beats and pieces. Okay, so, hello Janet. Hi Lucy. What's your goss? Uh, I haven't really got anything. Nothing. I'm sure I could think of something. You got a holiday book? No, not yet. No, I haven't either. No. Oh, could all do right, Claire. One. Claire's a little bit excited. She's like, I gotta go holiday week today. Which holiday is this one, Claire? Oh, it's going to Cape Verde. <sighs> That's not fair, is it? No, it's not. No, no. I am going to. Um, I might. I don't know how I feel about it. I might go away to see my brother in Kuala Lumpur by myself for a week. But I don't think I can leave Charlie for a week. Or Drew. I don't. I don't. Ah. Oh. But the idea of just having a week, or just even a day to myself, is like, oh, wow. Fab. Oh, think about anyway, it. Anyway, I'll, I'll have a think. I'll probably, I'll probably chicken out. Anyway, any road, right. What an amazing kit. What an amazing kit. We're going to look at it in more detail, in full detail later in the show. But this is a massive saving when we do it later. There's three strands of rainbow coated pyrite. That's actually a metallic coating on top there of the pyrite. See the, see the natural tone of the pyrite, the golden tones there and then manipulate it into this rainbow spectacular of pinks and greens and blues. Then you've got this fabulous findings pack, which is the nine two, sorry, it's the silver plated copper findings. This is the one, there's 100 findings, uh, sorry, 114 findings in a meter of chain. So that's that findings pack that you're going to be receiving. And then what's really fab is, Janet has is amazing in so many different genres of jewellery making, but particularly within the world of crochet and knitting as well with, uh, with jewellery making. So we're actually going to be seeing a tool that we've got in today's show in action during the challenge to effectively braid the organza ribbon, giving the organza ribbon a completely different look. Look at the amount of ribbon there is. 200 metres of organza ribbon. Do you think you've got enough to keep you going? I think I might have. Are you, are you sure? I'll um, do a bit more. I was trying to stretch it out a bit. Because <laughs> <laughs> of course you've got all of your threading materials as well. 50 metres of beading thread, 6 metres clear elastic and 80 metres of monofilament. I need longer than four hours. I think you probably do. Yeah. Um, so in terms of initial ideas for designs, what are you thinking? Okay, I think we'll try with the uh, knitting spool with ribbon. Yeah. Um, I've not tried it with ribbon, so that'll be interesting to see what okay. effect that does. Um, so perhaps make a cord with that. Um, but these stones are just beautiful, aren't they? And they're really, they are. you can really, when you make a piece of jewellery, you can feel that you're wearing it, it makes you feel good. So, looks, yeah. So, I don't know, we'll see how it evolves. Fabulous. And can I just say, I'm loving the colour ensemble and the ma you. matches your glasses, amazing yes. though. Thank you. Yeah, I'm getting new specs. Oh, I don't hate buying new glasses. Do you say you like it and now you need new specs? I like yours and it's in Now you need new specs. I, yeah. yeah. That just didn't it's sound quite right. Did it not? <laughs> Oh, I, I really like your glasses. No, no. <laughs> I'm getting new glasses. Oh, I like That's your hair as well, by the way. You like my hair? Yeah. No one's noticed. I, I've noticed. It looks good. Thanks. Yeah. No one else has noticed. And now it's gone. What, how does it look different? Go on, Mike. It's glossy. It's <laughs> glossy. That'll be hairspray. Thanks. It's now gone a little bit lighter. Yeah, it looks good. And a little bit shorter. And I just thought... I need to get rid of my grey, so that's what I did. Um, no, I, yeah, I was looking at your glasses and then I thought, yeah, I'm desperate to get new glasses. Yeah. Your glasses are really nice. I really need nice new glasses. They're really nice. They're, they're not bad. Yeah, they're lovely. Oh yeah, I've got my Gox. In fact, I might put my Gox on now. Hello. Uh, right, we, no, I don't need them on the set. I'll save them for later for when my eyes really hurt. It's like, there's something to look forward to. <laughs> right. 
brand new spanking bundle here of oh what a shame okay we've we've got oh my word right we have got the most ridiculous deal 7.95 7.95 for 20 meters of real suede 7.95 for 20 meters of real suede good luck everyone amelia i need you i need you let's get them packing let's get them packing Let's unpack all of these. Let's get them packing. Let's get them packing. did it, but the camera was coming back to this desk. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Right, come on. Get cracking, girl. Let's get unpacking. And what you're looking at here is we're going to unpack one of these packs, and you are, in fact, going to be receiving two. So you've got this gorgeous mustardy tone. You've got that gorgeous, rich, royal blue. The royals are over on, um, in New Zealand at the moment. We keep saying that they're over in Australia at the moment. They're not. They're in New Zealand. They're in the town where my husband is to, tomorrow, today, tomorrow, uh, in about 12 hours. I know, in Cambridge in New Zealand uh, so that's the royal blue that you've got there gorgeous purples and lilacs I'm loving the delicate nature that Amelia is literally flinging these at me <laughs> she's <laughs> thank you darling uh, you've got that gorgeous appetite uh, green there and the pink so every color that you're seeing here you're actually going to get this twice over masses of you on the phone line 7.95 for 20 meters of real suede leather genuine suede leather and they are continual meters as well it's not like you're getting snippets of them um, free phone number 0800 644 655 now of course you can do very simple plaits you can of course do kumihimo you can macrame with them you can in fact use them on the uh, spool that we've got coming up later in the show this is the threading material it's amazing using it within of course all the rest of the leather piece of jewelry that you're probably making using the starter kit and the sort of area that natalia is very much focusing in on um, and then just even simply popping them side by side is really 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 fashionable and just literally wearing it like that is so fashionable literally just use a couple of findings um, that will be featuring in the today's show that is maybe with the matrix box that is so fashionable at the moment I can't tell you and maybe just create out of wire your own class but the end of it and um, I've got masses of you on the phone lines if you haven't yet confirmed your order we do need confirmation as soon as possible the pack that I'm showing you here on my hand you're gonna get that again you're gonna get twice over so it's effectively what's the pack of price of one pack usually Oh eight hundred six double four six double five. Fantastic saving for getting the two packs. Well done to those of you who are getting more than one as well uh, I've got Christine and Kathleen and Gail and the Ka another Kathleen um, and I've got lots of Kathleen's and lots of Lynn's on the phone line. Hmm, slightly different spellings of all. Um, Lorraine and Susan and Zena and Rosemary and Claire and Jane and Ariane and Mavis. Hugest congratulations. Uh, 7 95 for 20 metres of leather suede. That's extraordinary, isn't it? That's a crazy price. Because if you're going to some haberdashery stores, you'll pay you know for a metre you'll pay a few quid for, for a metre yeah easily and you're getting 20 metres 20 metres is really good quality it's genuine suede this is not suede it genuine suede leather good luck everyone it's 7.95 and I do think there's a lot of scope for using that as well how many of you um, knit and have made lovely cardigans and then what's really really in fashion as well at the moment is sort of you know I wear a lot of cardigans is around the edging of the cardigan is actually to sew leather like this through it you can charge a fortune you can charge an absolute fortune also what's really really in fashion is this color at the moment as a pendant using silver that alongside it that is just gorgeous you want a bag in this color have you seen the bag I've got with me set up? It's a bit more musty. I've got loads of bags that colour. I think that's really... Oh, just got loads of handbags. I'm a bit... Yeah, I'm, I'm a bagaholic. Pardon? Bring it in? Do you want to bring my bag in for me? No, thank you, darling. It's a bit like Mary Poppins and that as well at the moment. It's just like my whole life's... I'm cut I might as well just have a suitcase everywhere I go. I end up carrying bags and bags and bags and bags. Seven pounds and 95 pence. I'm feeling a cup of tea coming on. I know you're on cameras at the moment, Amelia. Don't worry. I know exactly where you're at. I can spot you here. Now, you've got fabulous glasses as well. Oh, thank you. And you've both got colour glasses. So you've got purple 
uh, Janet, and you've got blue, blue and purple. Yeah, blue and purple. We're stylish, aren't, aren't we? we? Oh. <laughs> they are stylish. Mine are brown. Go with your hair. To go with my hair. That's going blonder. Yeah. So really. Paint your glasses with nail varnish. Paint my glasses with nail varnish. No. That's <laughs> Amelia, everybody. She is our resident pet. <laughs> yeah. She's just meow for you. <laughs> I've said it before and I'll say it again. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. We are not your average shopping channel. Do you know anyone else who has a floor manager and technical operator who's also a resident pet? Now, talking about animals, can I just say, oh, I'll tell you I'm all about the glamour today. Have you heard about this problem with the rats? No. In the UK at the moment. Well, the uh, end of my mum and dad's neighbour's garden and a very beautifully manicured area, and I mean, it's all pristine around there. They thought they'd seen some massive, big black rats. And apparently, this is a major problem developing in the UK, and they are huge, apparently. Oh, wow. Janet Street Porter apparently said on Loose Women the other day she had one in her living room. <gasps> I know! The last, one of the last times I was in London on the tube, because I think you sort of expect to see them on the tube and things, it's that sort of habitat, but not in a really beautifully manicured end of the garden, it's just a pier, like, what can I find here? Um, but last time I was in London, I was at Earl's Court tube station, on a rat, no word of a lie, got on the tube, and it's like it went, not a lot to see here really, and got off again, and I swear it was the size of a cat. Anyway, I'll just leave that thought with you. Anyone else that anyone got rats? I haven't got rats. I have not got rats, but I just thought I'd tell you the story. An interesting story about rats. You've got an interesting story about rats. Is it actually interesting though, Amelia? It is. is it? Yeah. Would you like to come and tell the viewers our interesting story about rats? I can tell you. And you can tell me. Go on then. Um, when I was in the Gambia. When you were in the Gambia. Um, the university. Oh, I'm talking about being on a tube in London. <laughs> Sorry, darling. When when Amelia was in the Gambia. They have such large rats. They train them as um, sniffer dogs. They have such large rats. They train train them as sniffer dogs. Yeah, and then they can obviously detect. They have a fantastic sense of smell. That's incredible. Yeah. Claire, Director Claire has just gone, I'm so glad that was a good story because I'm really relieved because for a moment, you never, sometimes you don't know what's going to come out of Amelia's mouth. Bless true. Her. But that was a true story. Lovely. Uh, right then, um, coming up for you, I've got an amazing, amazing findings pack later. We've got loads and loads of, loads of deals. But which one would you like to do? Mm. Right, we did a very similar one yesterday. It sold out. This is going to sell out today because we are in the last of stock, I'm afraid. But it is an incredible way of getting a huge volume. 2,400 findings pack. 2,400, right. We're obviously going to sell out of it. The last time it sold, hundreds flew out. We have got less than 50 left today. Now, once you have once you've established yourself as a jewelry making or once you start, the absolute essential thing that you do need are findings. This has actually got 2,000, I'll be really honest with you, it's 2,100 of those findings are the little balls. So have a look at these. Now, yesterday on the show, I was discussing with Debbie Kershaw how much we think one of these pots would be, it was the gold color on yesterday's show, in a bead shop. How much would you pay for 2,100 beads? A ridiculous amount of money. Have you got any okay. idea? It's been such a long time since I've sort of shopped anywhere else. I think that's the problem because all of us just shop here now. We've sort of lost contact. I think Debbie thought, oh gosh, I can't remember, between 20 and 30 pounds for that tub. Easily, I would say. Easily? Yeah. I'd be saying sort of 20 plus, yeah. 20 plus. We're not saying indicatively, we're not doing direct price comparisons, we're just getting sort of a general idea. Now then, what's brilliant about this is it really, 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 look at the quantity going down already. They, they, you've got great jump rings in here as well. So let me just check. Yeah, there's 200 jump rings and they are saw cut. They're saw cut, so they're perfect for chain mail. 200 jump rings. Shepherd hooks, you're going to get 60. And they are, the jump rings, by the way, are, let me get a size for you, five millimeters, the jump rings. Um, you're going to get 60. What are you doing, Kim? It sounds like you're about to explode the computer. Oh, it's Claire. Goodness me, there's some severe typing going on in there. Um, 
These are your ear wires, and you're going to get 60 of these. Okay, 60 of these. Look at the look at the quantity going down. We've got less than 20. Less than 20. Okay, three one meter lengths of um, of chain, and your ribbon cord and a massive toggle clasps as well. Here we go. We're going to bring the price in. I'll continue to show you exactly what you're getting. 25.95 is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. 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 So with your toggle clasps that you're seeing here as well, you can use these for cufflinks, you can set polymer clay into them, you can also use them as a toggle clasp, you can get 30 of those. With the S clasp um, and the extender chain and ribbon cord ends, you're going to be getting eight of these. You can actually stamp into uh, the ends of these as well, so you can really personalise your jewellery. That'd be good, great actually, if you've got the suede cord, they're great for attaching your leather suede to uh, pieces as well. And then the chain, now all of these, this is extraordinary value for money. Three one meter lengths of chain, twenty five ninety five for all of these. I think actually yesterday the gold colour was. Oh gosh, I can't remember now. It was a lot more than that. Twenty five ninety five. We've got eleven of these left. It's an absolute essential findings pack. Now, if you are loving silver, but you would like a precious. Um, actual 925 stunning silver we've got 925 stunning silver with a nine carat rose gold overlay coming up later in one of the biggest savings we've ever done for finding so make sure you stay in tune for that that'll be the rose gold color this is your silver color for stash building findings and you are also going to be getting the actual storage as well now we've got nine people with, with this in their baskets and I've got people on the phone lines and look, so they're obviously gonna go. Now, if it's in your basket and you haven't yet checked it out and there's somebody on the phone line who wants it, someone is gonna be getting that out of your basket. There's two of these left. It's on a first purchase, first serve basis. It's the fairest way we can do it. Only one left and they've now all gone. Please stop calling for that. Please stop calling. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go over. Oh, oh no. Oh, it's okay. I thought the findings had ended up in my tub of strawberries, but the tin foil was still on them. Uh, right, let's go over and do the first kit with Janet. Now, I have to warn you, this is going to such a great price. I think it could probably sell out before we even get to a demo. Um, it's going to be one of the most amazing prices, one of the most amazing prices of kits. And I just, oh, it's fabulous. A free gift of wire as well. It was beautiful. I so opened it, it and it's a, it's a gift. If I tell you that this is not going to even be 24 95 it's going to be lower than that. <laughs> See, that's the thing. You don't know how much it's going to be when you no, get it. No, um, But, yeah, I'd say way above that. <laughs> I love it when we've got a bargain. It's on a first come, first serve basis. Look at everything you can make now. Um, Janet has been able to make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pieces of genuine gemstone jewellery. Each piece of jewellery has got amazing gemstone detail in it. So, if we first of all start off at this piece here, the wire, you're going to be getting as a free gift 10 metres of 0.4 wire, and that's in that gorgeous pink colour. Look at that for a design. Janet, that's gorgeous. Even just your detailing of using the pink there on the wire. Well, I thought the pink then um, against the silver just sort of, it ties the whole piece together mm. rather than having just silver at either end of the uh, pendant. That's stunning. If we just have a look at the back as well, the attention to detail, you're going to get all of these findings. You are going to be getting 114 findings and a meter of chain, otherwise known as 115 findings, you know me though. Now have a look at your findings pack. This is the flowers finding pack. So the attention to detail within this, you can see you've got your plain chain, you've got 45 um, head pins. So with your head pins, you're gonna get 30 with a ball on the end, 15 are slightly slimmer than another 15, and the other 15 have got these really lovely stars or flowers, however you'd like to look at them, ends to them. And in fact, the end of the hand pin, you can see on this design here, isn't that lovely the way that Janet's used the head pin so you can actually see the detail, like, gorgeous. And on the drop of those amazing quartz, we'll come to that in just a second, I've botched my nail already, haven't I? Um, right, so loads of extra findings, we'll have a look at some more as we go along. So if we start with this, this pair of earrings here and the gemstone in situ, this is a quenched crackled quartz in the fuchsia. 
are actually um, pink is Brimfoti, well pink, fuchsia, at uh, 10 by 8 millimetres. You're going to get that full strand, aren't they beautiful? These are all 38 centimetres in length, these strands, okay? Um, stock is flying out already, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous colour of kit. It's feminine without being too in your face feminine. It's classy, it's really, really classy. Um, and then the accenting beads at the top of those, this is really, really pretty. These are clear quartz faceted rounds at four millimetres. They're so, 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 so versatile, especially because they're faceted. They really, 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 really sparkle. We've got lots of you already on the phone lines. So if you just have a look at these, um, yeah, the accenting, I can't get that word out, accenting, thank you. And that's that full 38 centimetre strand there, okay? Then as we work our way along, look at this for crocheting technique. How fabulous is that? <coughs> Using the beading thread. Oh my word. Janet, that's amazing and it matches this pendant so beautifully. Look at this. Now you can see <coughs> dangling from the pendant, you've got these gorgeous mystic rose quartz. And they are six millimetres in diameter. And that's that strand there. Again, full 38 centimetre strand. Every single ingredient that you can see within the jewellery that Janet has made has come from this kit. Nothing other than what comes in the kit has been used and no duplicating either. So this is all from just one kit. We've already just seen those little earrings there, gorgeous. Um, another crocheting technique, but incorporating gemstones, making those amazing rosette style earrings. And then have a look at the findings here. Aren't they gorgeous? They're lovely to use, aren't oh, they? Beautiful, aren't they? <clears throat> that, you're halfway there. With findings like that, you know, your piece of jewellery is halfway there. Yeah. You know, it makes life so much easier. And just and you get that those. detail. Absolutely. Great detail and ridiculous low price for all of this. Gorgeous necklace, just giving a little bit of colour to the neckline. And a simple plait of the beading thread has given nice detailing to simple beading thread. And if I just turn this around, you can see another of the toggle clasps, excuse me, in situ just there. Uh, the clasp on the back of this one using the chain that you also get. Janet's manipulated one of the earring findings. Oh, sorry. No, head one pin. of the head pins. Yeah. Apologies. Okay, and then the final piece, oh sorry, no, there's another pair of earrings, it just goes on and on and on. Now then, look, Janet's used the star slash flower uh, head pins to actually create her own shepherd hooks. And don't they look lovely with these gorgeous, you're going to get ten of these, and these are the little flower um, spaces. And then this necklace here is gorgeous again, using once again a crocheting technique with this lovely connector piece that you're also going to be getting. You get everything. And then an interchangeable. Is it interchangeable? Oh no, I thought it was no, interchangeable. It's, it's that just one. attached to the. It is um, attached. Yeah, attached to the clasp. Isn't that gorgeous? It could be interchangeable though. I was just thinking, yeah. I thought with a little lobster could have clasp, done that, it yeah. could be. Easy, isn't it? This is an amazing kit. Now, it's massively reduced and then a freebie is thrown in as well. So you're getting a huge saving. You're gonna get a show price on this. Now it's called Morning Dew Drops. Should be looking at £34.20. £24.95 would be amazing. It's literally on a first come first serve basis. We're going under £20 on a first come first serve basis. Good luck and if you want more than one, of course grab more than one. If this is what you're in the market for, if you're looking for a massive silver findings, if you love the pink colours, then why don't you get it twice? If this is your type of kit, indulge and get it twice over because the saving, the more you buy, the more you save. Free phone number 0800 644 655 and you've got 100 carats of the pink rainbow coated quartz otherwise I don't know if I've called it pink rather than rose quartz there to be honest. No idea. Uh, 19.95 and then you've got 10 meters of the fuchsia wire in there as well. Once again if it's in your basket check out your basket. Now Janet what are you going to demo for us? I thought maybe the the first pair of earrings. Beautiful. With the little, with the little drops. Really really beautiful. I think they, they just go so lovely together and the drops are great because that's sort of top drilled yeah. through and you can do so much with them. They're really, really versatile. Fab. Right. Would you mind if I just leave you to it for a second while I'm desperate for some water? No problem. It'll be all that smoked salmon and egg that <laughs> was vile this morning. It's made me thirsty. I'm just standing here. Okay. So for this, what I did, I used the, um, the really fine head pin that we've got because um, 
they're a really good length. And what I did is I just cut off the little ball at the end, so we've got the head pin. And then slip that through one of your drops. Keep it shorter at one end and just leave yourself a little bit longer at the other. And then thread on two of the smaller, which are absolutely beautifully faceted, absolutely gorgeous, two at either end. A bit difficult to see where the hole is because it's that's so clear. There we go. So you've got that little longer at one end um, and two on either side. So then simply just bend, bend those together. So you've got that drop shape. Just try and sort of keep it central if you can. There you go. And then take another um, of the small stones and just thread both of those through through the one. There you go. And then you've got that. There we are. So then just slip that all the way down, she says. And then just try and even that up by pulling either side. There we go. And then that side. Just see what I'm doing. There we go. Pull that. So you've got then effectively that's that's the drop. Mm -hmm. Okie doke. So take the shorter end you've got and just move that out of the way for a second. The longer end, just put in your round nose pliers near the near the top section there and bring that around and then we're just going to do a bit of a wrap loop on there just to make sure that that's secure and to make the loop then to hang onto the shepherd's hook. Wrap that around a few times. Just try and keep it as neat as you can. There you go. And then snip that off. I'm a bit annoyed actually because someone in my house has been using my flush cutter pliers and I've got little dents in them. <gasps> Who I should do be you suspect? I should be having words with my other half when I get home. <laughs> I was going to say, have you got any animals? I have, but she doesn't use pliers much. No, the dog's not very good with pliers. No. He hasn't been, uh, your other half's not been cutting her nails with them, right? Well, it? he's been doing something with them because I've got little dents in them. Yeah, so. just. Uh, Watch it, you yeah. lot out there, making jewelry makeup pliers. Mm -hmm. Get your own. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Lucy. So there you go. So you've got the little loop and you've got this little extra tail then. So if you hold the loop, just wrap that round. Um, try and keep it as neat as you can. Just sort of a bit of a finishing finishing detail. Snip that off. If I can see where I'm going. There we go. And then just squidge that in so it's tight. Tighten it all up. And there you go. And then you just simply drop that onto whichever of the um, shepherd hooks out of the um, findings pack. Fabulous. That you want. Really fabulous. So it's an they easy just, technique. They're so simple, yeah. but so, so effective. Now, for all of you who are brand new to jewelry making, that's a great, simple technique that's so effective. Remember, you're using genuine gemstones when you shop from us here at Jewelry Maker. So there's no need, with our price comparisons, there's no need to go and buy glass and plastic you can go straight in with genuine gemstones now with your first purchase you're going to receive this for free so jump on the phone line grab your kit and we'll send one of these to you for free with your first order it's a dvd and a booklet to get yourself started and a bit more advanced as well and then each month you make a purchase for your first order of the month you'll get the latest edition of the jm hub magazine keeping up to date with all the uh, shenanigans that are taking place and believe me there's a lot of shenanigans here um, this is an example of what you're going to be seeing on the dvd that you'll be receiving for free now then how many of the kids have we got left there kimberly okay we had a great quantity to start with we've got an all right amount left so the reality is this kit should be over 34 pounds now if you were to buy everything tomorrow off our website it would come to 34 pounds and 20 pence what's happened is the price has been massively reduced and then of course you've got the um, you get the so, you be here me? Can't get my teeth in. Done a DVD this morning. Don't know who I am anymore. Um, you're going to get a free 10 meter reel of wire in there as bonus gift. You've also got all the thread materials, all the findings, and the gemstones, genuine gemstones. Tomorrow morning at a competitive price, it's 34 pounds and 20 pence. Right here, right now. Show price 19.95. Massive saving. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Gorgeous kit. Thank you for your jewellery that you've done there. That's beautiful. So it will be photographed and put up onto the website <coughs> to see me. later as well. I was going to say it was a pleasure.
because it's such a beautiful kit to work with. The colours were just lovely. And I'm not really a pinky, a girly girl. That's but these what I was pinks like, this, were beautiful. That's it. It's not girly girly. It's no. it's beautiful. It's soft and it's a beautiful kit. feminine. It's gorgeous. Yeah. With that price, you might as well, even if you're not going to use it in the contents of the kit, you might as well get the contents of it and whack it in your stash. Uh, in your stash. Uh, right. We're going to do some more amazing findings in a moment. Enjoy your challenge. Thank you again, Thank Janet. You. You're fabulous. Gorgeous, gorgeous jewelry from Janet. Now, coming up around about 11 o'clock, we have got one of the biggest savings we've ever done on rose gold 925 sterling silver findings. We expect it to be groundbreakingly amazing. In the meantime, however, to be honest, that is an offer that should be in a trade show. We're doing a trade show price on that trade show offer and in fact we're going to do some other trade show offers throughout the show okay which one sorry we're going to do a crash bang wallop sale price clearance offer on this clearance 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 we are <laughs> to say this is clearance is an understatement trashing the price it's pardon yeah massively lower than staff cost and just ridiculous I'll tell you the reason why. So, um, when we have had product, am I making sense? Is Amelia around? Amelia, I could do with a cup of tea. Could I have a cup of tea, please? Oh, Amelia, could I have a cup of tea? Could I have a cup of tea? <laughs> Joan, <laughs> good morning, Lucy. I've heard you had a nice voice, but until this morning, I hadn't heard it. What do you mean? <laughs> um, well, it's true, you have a lovely voice. Keep singing. Thank you very much. I don't know if you know this, but I do take the mickey out of my own voice. Um, I did actually used to be in West End musicals, and I've sung with lots of pop stars. So, uh, and I also still teach singing, so... Um, yeah, got a pupil tomorrow afternoon. Um, so yes, I am actually also something you might not know. I'm actually a trained opera singer. Woo! No, you're not hearing opera. I'm here to do jewelry maker. No. <laughs> Amelia, that was really. Imp She's actually got under the desk like a cat. <laughs> Amelia, that was really impressive. <laughs> You have a tape recorder in your pocket because she's from the 1980s. Uh, <laughs> right, Amelia, that was impressive. So, Joan, thank you very much, lovely. I know it's just that you don't sit on TV and sing opera, do you really? And um, Amelia, my mug's there. I just love my cup of tea more than I actually love you. That'd be pretty huge. Thanks, doll. Right, back to this then. So. What happens is when we get stock in, it automatically gets given a code. Once that code has been in our system for a certain length of time, it immediately gets processed into clearance mode and we have to start looking at, right, why is it not being, um, why is it not sold, what we've got to do about the price, da -da 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 -da. The reason that these have not sold um, until the, sort of the time that, uh, haven't sold before their clearance time on in the system is simply because they've not been seen on air that often at all how could you buy them bit of an oversight now it's going to be a corker and if you were getting the previous kit this is a staple essential i think to add to it to help it go even further now they are beautiful you've actually even got scope for a bit of soutache going on here look at that mm. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous colours. Absolutely beautiful colours. So, you've got multicolour crackle quartz rectangles, you've got rose quartz flat ovals, and pink quartz rectangles, and they are amazing. This is the quenched crackled quartz, you've got two lots of them. Really stunningly super rich, 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 rich colours. And going to an unbelievable, this price unless we have any stock left, which I don't think we will, will never be repeated for this pack, categorically, because it is ludicrous. This is gonna sell out. You will never see this pack repeated on air at the price you're about to get, fact. Now, at the price before they went into clearance mode, it would have been 21.85, okay? It's on a first come first serve basis. Oh my word, you've got 38 centimeters on each. As you're looking at this, 
You're seeing strands, yes, but look at the sheer volume of gemstones you get. You might decide to use these all together, you might not. You might actually decide to sell these on, on a very well-known auction website as individual strands. Oh my goodness, go for it. Because you are about to get lower than trade price, lower than staff costs, lower than any price they've ever dreamt of being before, and using the code CWGC43, you're about to get a massive clearance price. £12 for the lot. Have you seen the size of those rose quartz? And they're genuine, natural rose quartz. Can I just confirm? Yeah, that is natural rose quartz. Absolutely natural rose quartz, a full 38 centimetre strand, included there for £12. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, ridiculous, ridiculous. 0800 644 They are amazing. Amazing. They are really amazing. Yeah. Oh. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to be cool, Janet, yeah, aww. <clears throat> but whenever I try to be cool, I realise I only know music that's played on Radio 2, so I'm not that cool. I'm a bit of a, I only listen to Radio 2, which is your radio station preference? Radio 1. I Are love you? Radio 1. My other half, Radio 2. Aren't you cool? I, I don't think I'm cool, but I just love... Radio 1? Mm. You're no, really cool. It. Yeah. I go between Radio 4 and Radio 2. Yeah, seriously. Occasionally, Radio 1, if I've lost signal on Radio 2. <laughs> Part of the town where I drive through, I have to flick onto Radio 1. Mm. What, are you a Radio 1, 2, 3, 4, local? Well, actually, I've got a new CD. you got a new CD. Yeah. What's the CD, Amelia? Um, it is, what is it called now? Um, yes, I can, that one. Um, best movie soundtrack. Oh, I yes, love that type of thing. Yes. Best movie soundtrack, I yeah. love that. Yeah, that's great. Yeah? Do you know what I'm really loving at the mm. moment? Movie soundtrack. Mm. It's Beethoven Symphony. And um, it's from The King's Speech. Oh. Oh. And it's a Beethoven Symphony. I love that. Yeah. Oh. At the same time, I also, of course, love Kenny G. And my music taste is then um, old, isn't it? <laughs> However, love I am that. loving the other song that I'm loving. And I think I said this on air yesterday. And this is how Charlie and I now start our day. So, if I wake and we go, Charlie, it's time to wake up, and I'll put it on this. It might seem crazy when I'm about to say, da -da 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 -da, that happy Pharrell Williams, because I'm happy, da -da 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 -da. and Charlie does this, and his car is asleep, and he goes, da -da -da. <laughs> and he wakes up, his eyes are still shut, yeah, yeah, and we have a little boogie to happy, that's how we start our day. Unless he's teething, which is a whole different scenario, and it's not happy. Anyway, I thought I'd tell you my life story while these are selling out, and most people are bulk buying whilst that's on offer at £12. How many left there, Kimbo? Pardon? Okay, um, we've got a good quantity left-ish, sort of. We've had a massive quantity. We've got about a quarter of the stock left. At £12, it's a bargain. In fact, that price is, Mike, I haven't heard from you in ages. The price is... Very impressive indeed. No, come on, you can do it. Don't let me down. The price is... Phenomenal. 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 £12. Amazing. That was... Do you know what? We're going to win an Oscar for that. Should we go to the Wall of Fame? Let's go to the Wall of Fame. You, Amelia, tell me to concentrate. Yes. Did you tell me? Yes. This is scatty gorgeous little Amelia. Amelia, who's what's your favourite movie soundtrack then? Oh, at the moment I'm liking a bit of um, Against All Odds, Phil Collins. Against All Odds, yeah, Phil Collins. I'm loving a bit of Phil Collins. Yeah. Yeah. Are you a Phil Collins fan, Janet? Um, used to be, maybe. Yeah, that's because we're obviously dated. The Tarzan soundtrack. Um, is that all Phil Collins, Tarzan? Oh, hang on, it's... I won't sing. I'll dance, but I won't sing. 
Uh, right, should we do the Wall of Fame? <laughs> oh, wow. <gasps> That's pretty. Isn't it? Four, two, nine. Look at this. Check it out, Janet. Dancing on the show. I'm loving it. This is from Sharon. This is lovely. And um, my entry to the um, Wall of Fame. A J, uh, sorry, a polymer clay and wire crochet brooch. All JM products. Regards from Sharon. Sharon, that is so, so pretty. Beautiful, hun. Four, two, nine. Best of luck to you. And um, this is four, three, zero. Oh. Beautiful. I love uh, pearls, rose quartz. That yeah. is stunning. So this is from uh, Bryony. I don't know where Bryony. Oh, Bryony Gibson. I don't know where Bryony is, but Bryony says pearls and rose quartz from JM. Um, and sterling silver clasp made by me. Wow. So Bryony's obviously used wire there and hammered, yeah. hammered that. Amazing. That's beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Really stunning. And that's 430. 430. So I always forget that you can wire, uh, hammer wire. Yeah. But quite often we'll do something and go, oh, I could have done that. <laughs> Oh, right, 431. This is from Marion Boyce in Oxford. My latest Soutache attempt. Wow. Well, uh, I have been, I've loved having a go at building up the layers and drawing the designs with gemstones and the glass beads from my stash. It is so tidy and I'm so proud of it. So you should be Marianne and tell you what, Linda would be incredibly proud of that as well. That's beautiful. That's really fab, but you're 431. Good luck. And this is uh, 432 really really pretty and this is from Karen um, in Devon oh. and she says hi everyone I couldn't wait to show you what I made for my mum for Mother's Day uh, it's made uh, from everything from JM such good quality and wonderful things on the show it's sterling silver pendant with sterling silver chain it's got all my family's birthday stones on mm. it oh, two sapphires aquamarine amethyst and topaz I hope you like it my mum loved it I'm sure she did that's absolutely beautiful Karen, isn't it? what a great idea and then Great to have idea. all the different stones, birthstones, is really lovely. So personal. And that's 432. Good luck there, lovely. And then the final one for now, three gorgeous pairs of earrings. 433, I totally wear all of these. Attached is a photo of three simple but elegant, I hope, she said. A pairs of earrings from JM's Gems, respectively, uh, Magnesite, Adventurine and Rose Quartz, all featuring quartz stars. And that's from Sheila Pryor. Sheila, they're really lovely. Very Kate Middleton. Simple elegance. And you are 433. Three. Now, coming up for you throughout the show, we have got some amazing, amazing, amazing deals. We've got that. So, well, we've got a trade offer uh, on findings coming up for you. But also, look at this. That is natural Brazilian emerald coming up later on in the show, around about 12 o'clock. Before then, we are also going to be featuring the most amazing, the largest, the largest ruby nuggets I've ever, ever, ever presented. They're huge, they're natural. Amazing. Now, if you love a frosted look to a gemstone, you're going to love those. They're going under. No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't go anywhere, though. And if you want to know how you can shop from us here, here's how you can do it. The fastest way to shop with Jewelry Maker is by going to our website. Just click on the sign up button. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the watch live button on the front page. You can also use our refine tool and narrow down your search. Once you've found an item that you like, just simply click on the buy now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day and still only pay one p and Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. If for any reason you're not satisfied, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. We all know having the right tools for the job is important, so we here at Jewelry Maker have designed a toolkit which includes all your essential pliers for jewelry making, including round nose and flat nose pliers, wire cutters, as well as a bead reamer, snips and tweezers. You've got everything you need for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. When you place your first order with us, you will receive a free booklet and DVD full of handy hints, tips and tutorials to help you get started with your new jewellery maker hobby. If you have a question or query for jewellery maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewellerymaker.com. 
You can watch Jewelry Maker Live every day from 9 till 1 on Sky 655, Virgin 756, Freesat 807 and now Freeview Channel 30. You are watching Jewelry Maker and thank you so much for joining us. We have got so much going on in today's show. Can, 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 I, just, can I just say this? Right, first of all, oh my word, we're going to do trade show offer in today's show on rose gold 925 sterling silver finings. We have got a massive quantity. We're going to do a massive trade offer. It's going to be immense coming up around about 11 around about 11 o'clock just and then look at this it's just arrived on my table wow double trouble deal and emeralds ruby sapphires come on come on come on um okay where should we go to first then kimberly should we do the ruby right now Okay, oh my word, we're going to do it right now. Okay, um, I can tell you right at this point, categorically, definitively, I've never presented a strand like this and there's never been a strand like this before on the show. It will be a price that will be absolutely ridiculous, completely, Kim. And um, she's just said, warn everybody, the phone lines are going to go ballistic. Okay, what you're about to see is Ruby in in a quite a natural state but for natural ruby the quality is amazing now you could if you've got a stone tumbler I don't know if could you then tumble these and polish them up yourself I wonder if you could do you know who'd know that Debbie Bulford because she does that with some stones sometimes and her husband does as well and Debbie's in the building can we call Hannah Oxbury and ask her because the opportunity here is immense. Now it's got a matte finish, so effectively they've not been polished. All that's happened here is they've been cut. And you've got 95 carats. I've just had confirmation if you've got the right equipment, yes, you could polish these yourself. So if you didn't want this look, so that's something to think about because the price, I, do you know what? How many have we got? Oh, right, we're gonna sell out, we're gonna sell out. We've got masses of them. You are going to get a price that is ridiculous for this. I'm gonna tell you now, they're going under 20 pounds if you want two. I know, under 10 pounds, under 10 pounds, under 10 pounds. Rubies, under 10 pounds, rubies, under 10 pounds. Talk about beyond a lower, lower than a trade price. Buy more than one of these. If you're a fan of rubies, if it's your birthstone, if it's your wedding anniversary coming up, 15th or 40th wedding anniversary. Seriously, this is genuine. Now it's completely natural, 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 natural ruby. You're not seeing the red tones particularly well through on there on the screen. If you want to go and get these polished somewhere, you, you, obviously then you get a very polished look. They haven't gone through a polish process. It keeps the price down. But if you're loving a matte gemstone, they're amazing. But also just even to have them, to say that you've got ruby in a design. I actually think the scope for using these with red tigers as well, they're going under 10 pounds for 95 carats of ruby. This is ridiculous. I'm gonna be honest, we've got more than 200 strands. We've got more than 200. Talk about a bulk buy. Now look as well, this has been um, put together in our very own workshops in Jaipur in India. So they've been sourced directly from the mines in Africa. This is African Ruby. Congratulations now, if you want more than one, we're going under 10 pounds. We're going under nine pounds for Ruby. If I'd have known about this yesterday, I would have told you, I'd have told you, I'd have told you. They literally have been arrived, they arrived in um, and got scheduled into the show, probably in the night, to be honest. We're a 24 hour operation here at the Genuine Gemstone Company. So a lot of, um, a lot of things take place in the night so we can be reactive to exactly what's going on in the industry. We can be reactive to 
exactly the deliveries that arrive when they arrive. Get more than one, we're going under eight pounds. If you've just tuned in, this is completely natural ruby. It has got a matte finish. If you're wanting a polished finish, you can get these polished up yourselves, or perhaps even if you've got the tools yourselves, you can do them. Um, Janet, they are 90, they're going under eight pounds. They're going under eight pounds, I feel sick. That's, that's ridiculous really, isn't it? Yeah. That's absolutely, and I love that frosty natural look. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely go and I'd put them with some pearls, some nice white <gasps> pearls. They would look beautiful with pearls, wouldn't they? Yes. That dark colour against the natural sort of... What sort of design are you thinking? Um, I don't, just something simple, elegant. Um, yeah. yeah. Know, maybe some of those across the front section and then just a pearl necklace. Beautiful. You see, I'm thinking something with wire as well, really twisting it and organic, like... Yeah. Mm. And I could indulge. I'd actually probably use about 180 carats of ruby because 95 carats when you can get two strands for less than £20, you might as well. Um, if you want three strands, go for it. This is genuine natural ruby. Um, if you just tuned in, we've got genuine natural ruby going under £8 for the whole strand. Now, you're guaranteed 95 carats. It measures the 17 centimetres, and that's from um, gemstone to gemstone. That doesn't include the tassels. They're going from approximately a 7 by 4 up to a 13 by 4, and you're going to get approximately 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 rubies. Now, for example, I've got some friends who have got red or have had red as part of their theme for their wedding. How about for the favours for the ladies? They have one of these on some wire and you make them a pendant to attach onto one of their own trains. Favour for a wedding, a ruby pendant. Hello. Hello. That's amazing. Isn't that would it? be amazing. Wouldn't isn't it? it? I'm really chuffed with that idea. Yeah, I'd bought by on this. Why don't you get, so approximately 19, approximately 95 carats, say the average amount of guests at a wedding is 120, half of those roughly are gonna be women, 60, so get yourself three, four strands of those, and you've got to put all the ladies sorted with ruby pendants for a wedding favour, in a little organza gift bag, or even wrapped up in a piece of tissue, wrapped up in some organza ribbon, and go around. I think that's a genius idea, don't you think that's genius? I think that's a genius idea, mm. buy it. Yeah, so do you know what? I've got people now bulk buying up to more of those. I think that's such a good idea. Can you text in if you've got any ideas? Text in if you think my idea is fabulous because I think that idea is fabulous and you'll make me feel great. <laughs> I'm joking. To text in though, tell me what are you thinking? Okay, if you're in a queue on the phone lines, don't worry. We know you're there. You're answered in the order that you press your option one. If you put this in your basket, check out. Seven by four millimetres up to a 13 by four. Genuine rubies. Did I say they were going under eight pounds? Oh no, did I? Oh, I lied. They're going under seven. <laughs> I love jewellery maker, yeah. 95 carats of ruby for 6.95. <laughs> Thank you for that, Kim. Kim was just like, yeah, for anyone who's just tuned in, if you channel clicking, you've just come across the channel for the first time. 6 95 for 95 carats of ruby, that's why I was doing this. Yeah, come on. Now, oh my word. Oh, buy these and get more than one. Seriously, buy more than one. When have you ever seen 95 carats of genuine? This is real, natural ruby. Real natural ruby. Doesn't it look amazing with that colour of tassel as well? Scope for perhaps, you can use silver or gold findings for these. Now in terms of low prices, can I tell you other things that are coming up in today's show? We've got a trade offer, trade price offer coming up in about an hour's time for 925 sterling silver, 9 carat rose gold findings. They're going to be amazing. Trade price coming up on those. The code is OLRU65. 0800 they're stunning, they're absolutely stunning. Seriously, buy more than one bulk buy, why wouldn't you? You could even, if you, were, if you sell at a craft fair, or if you sell anywhere, you could sell those individually, couldn't you? They're genuine rubies. Now, if you think about a crystal healing shop and what you'd pay for a tumbled loose stone of quartz. Quartz is very readily available, and how much would you pay? Probably anywhere up from £1.50 upwards, depending on the size of the stone. Don't you think? I think you could charge per ruby. A ruby, a genuine natural ruby. 
You can get certificates of authenticity as well from us. So if you want to prove it, you could have a little basket, ruby, choose your own rubies, certificate of authenticity in front. How much do you think? How much could you charge for one of those rubies? Sell to the people that make jewellery that don't shop from us here. Why they don't shop from us here, I haven't got a clue. Uh, 6 dollars They are amazing, amazing, amazing. How are we doing on stock there, Kimbo? Okay, um, we've got about a quarter of the stock left, uh, but we've got a lot of people on the phone lines. If you haven't yet confirmed your order, this, if you've just tuned in, is the 95 carat ruby, yeah, 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 at $6.95. I'm making myself cringe today. Right, let's go over. Now, we are about to show you a tool that I have never come across before. They've both got three. They've both got three. I've got a five. You've got a five one. These are both three. Which one should we do first? We'll do a three one first. And then we've got both there. Okay, hi. Um, which one would you like to do, the black or the red one? And what's the difference? <clears throat> There's no difference at all. They're just in different colour packaging and different size packaging. Let's go over here. Okay. What is this? I have no idea. Okay. Uh, it's essentially a braiding tool. So um, that you... And, and if I'm being totally honest, I got this about three, four days ago, and I've not used it before. Um, and it's really simple to use. Ace. Really, really easy to use. And you get this, this braid. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to cast off this, and I'll show you the full, full length of that so you'll be able to see it. Do you know what's just occurred to me as well? I know we talk a lot about tools and modes of jewellery making and genres of jewellery making that are easy to travel with if you're going on a plane if you're going to be you just want something you can shove in your handbag if you're, oh, i'm so sorry just whack my microphone and um, if you're going to be um you know needing something just to pop in your handbag this is such a dinky little size it's, it's fabulous cracking. and it's really easy to hold you can use it with all sorts of things when it, i briefly held it before yeah. the show because obviously with me dexterity issues um it's because it's a really good size it's great and it's got this ridge around so your thumb sort of sits in there really easily a natural sort of holding yeah. point yeah. okay so they come in three and five loops we're going to do a three one first what's the difference between the two they're exactly the same in technique you use them both in exactly the same way it's just that you get a thicker braid okay it's, so it's ideally you have both size. Yeah. really you need both yeah. okay um, so what you're able to achieve is a combination, it's a braid, it's a knitting slash braiding tool because you're going to get something that's a little bit kumihimo-esque, a little bit knitting-esque, a little bit crocheting-esque, but it's going to give you a very different pattern. So we're going to see how we use it. Okay, I won't use that one because that's my challenge. Okay. So can I use that one to cast on? Yes, of course. And then I'll show you how to yes. cast off okay. with that one. So you do get this and you get this. This is what you are going to get. Oh goodness me, this is in demand, it's flying out already. Okay, the code is FQBD23. Okay, so what you get is you get this with the, with the pins in, like you say, three and a five. <clears throat> and you get the little dowel that you use to, to stitch with. So first of all, drop your yarn, whatever you're using, wire, yarn, whatever you, it so is. So you could use wire in this? You can use wire, Brilliant. Uh, ribbon. Um, first time we've used ribbon, you can use ribbon on it. Mm. Uh, anything really, I think anything that you could possibly sort of knit with, you can use this with. So then, um, what you need to do is go around um, anti-clockwise or clockwise, whichever. So go around that first pin, go around that second pin, third pin, and you're there. So you've got. Do you get around. any instructions for this? The instructions are in there. Brilliant. Okay. So there's a little um, piece of paper in there that sort of tells okay, you. Okay. So how you'll to do get this. instructions. Okay. And then once you've gone around all of them, you've got that shape. So then. Try not to keep it, not, to, not too much tension on it at this stage because you need to be pulling these over. And then you simply slip your dowel into the bottom. So here, if I just show that again, we've gone around all of them. Yeah, can I just say this show is then live on YouTube at the moment. You can then, once we've gone live, you can then continue to rewind and replay. So you can see this on YouTube. Right, so it's round there, round that one. No, it isn't, round that way, round that way and back to that one so that the circle they're going round on the outside and then we're going to go back this way then oh julie you've just texted in can the knitting tool be used with wire like the viking knit yes it yeah. absolutely can 
And what gauge, what gauge wire do you reckon? Um, I reckon... Um, Up you to a 0.8 maybe? 0.6. I, I would think you'd probably... Um, it'd be harder to do after a 0.6. Okay. Um, but yeah, surely you could do a 0.6. Right, so you okay. go around, so every one has got a, a, a loop on them. And then what we're going to do now is we're going to go back in the opposite direction. So you go around that first loop that you made and go back. And then you've got two, sorry, there you go. You've got two loops on that one spool. So all we're going to do is pick, put, push the, um, the doweling tool in and simply pull that over, pull that bottom section and then turn it around. Then you're going around again, so you're wrapping it again on that second one, and you've got two, two stitches. So simply take that. Sorry, I need to get, there you go. And then slip that one over. Pull the bottom section. Turn it around again, and then you go across. It's so you've got literally two. literally like crochet. And yeah, and, and that, that I is basically it. totally. I'm going to be really honest, as somebody who's quite new to Kumihimo, I think this could, I think this would probably be more my thing to get me started in the world of braiding, because I can, quote, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm on it. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Now, if you wanted to add beads in. Yeah, if you want to add beads in, um, the best way to do it then is to thread the beads on here, and as you're going around, slip them in, slip them in here. So you put a bead in there. Um, make your stitch, do the next one, make your stitch, and the bead then is, is caught there. Mm. Or if you're using wire, you can put a piece of wire through the centre before you start with beads on mm. and sort of uh, braid around it That'll so you've lovely. got beads through the centre. Uh, and simply, and that is literally all you do. Oh, you need this in your life, you need to have it, you need to have it. So you're going to get, there's a lot of people already getting this now. Apparently, it's not actually been on air since October of last year. So maybe you've never seen it before. It, it's so incredibly simple to use. So the difference is we've got the three prong and we've got the five prong. With the five prong, you're gonna be getting a thicker um, product in the end. Yeah, but so exactly the same technique. It's just amazing. that you're using the five instead of, instead of the three. And as you go around, you just start building that up. And if we move to this one now. So all, all I've done with this is I've just continued round. And then you've got this section. And you just simply continue uh, until you've got the length that you want. Great. Um, shall I show you how to cast off? Yes, please. Okay, so to cast off, um, hopefully I remember. <laughs> so take a stitch, this is your stitch here, so we'll do one more stitch, goes over. Ideally be getting both of them, wouldn't you? Yeah. Get the three and the five. And then when you've done that stitch, simply pull that out. I know it seems a bit scary to do that, but like it's all going to unravel, off. but it doesn't. And then go around to the next one. Make your final stitch on that one. And again, you are going to get instructions with it. Yeah, and it does tell you the, how to do this. And then pull that through. And then the last, very last stitch, you might have to hold that a little bit because it's a little bit loose. It's going really quickly. And then take the last stitch over. Pull that down. Pull that through. And there you go. And there you, that's the end, so that's finished. And that's, that's your braid. How cool is that? How cool is that? Isn't it, it's great, isn't it? Yeah. Really, really, really fab. So, really, really quick, um, yep. really simple to do. And the code is FQBD23. So, the difference being, if you're gonna go for the three prong, you're gonna get a slightly narrower product. Um, oh, apparently lots of people are getting nostalgic. I bought one of these reels when I was, um, a kid and knitted me a sort of belt which I wore to school OMG in the infants at the time see even children then getting involved obviously there's a sharp point on there so we have to say adult supervision but lots of people getting nostalgic about it well go on grab yourself one I think the fact that it's it's incredibly comfy to hold you've got a resting point which is obviously very natural for your thumb and sort of the indentation of your thumb as well or the bulbous part of your thumb it feels comfy it's it's easy it's easy it's easy to do and it doesn't mess with your head <laughs> kumihimo messes with my head <laughs> 
simple all right fqbd to three anything simple at 12 pounds and 95 pence so you've got the three pong i'm gonna do the five pong in just a moment good luck everybody congratulations if you've already got it because my goodness this is in demand oh eight hundred six double four six double five so you've got your three prong we're gonna do a five prong in just a moment in an ideal world you'll be getting both and perhaps if you have used one in the past and you're thinking oh yeah i quite like that you see you can just see where janet has picked up from where she'd so really, ideally, you just want to keep going keep in going. the flow. <clears throat> As that's yeah. where the demo part would be done with for them to pick up and keep going. So um, if you want it a whole consistent one, maybe just find I think what I probably did is, is probably dropped a stitch or went back the wrong way. But, oh, okay. but if you just do it continually, that, that's the effect that you get. That is really, it's really, really, really good lovely. effect, isn't it? Really, really lovely. Brutal. Yeah. Who was that, sorry? Katie, was it? Oh, Tracy in the West Midlands saying your granddaughter does it. Five-year-old granddaughter uses it. I think it's, it's just perfect for anyone of any age range, isn't it? And the results are really, really fab. Really fab. And then I'm just looking at that and I'm thinking incorporating some beads on it. Just big. Yeah, be great. Use some wire and yeah. have beads on there. Little seed beads, maybe. Look great. Someone's just texting to say that they used to make placemats out of the braids. Could you roll them? That's yeah. amazing. Maybe you roll them. Roll placemat? Yeah. Big circle of them. That'd be good. Oh, that it? would be fab. That would be really fab. Now with, you wouldn't get through, do you know what? You would get through lots of leather cord down there, would you? I think but you with would. With the knots as well, yeah? So that le leather suede cord, yeah? Now we'll go back through the five one. So with the five one, is the hole a bit larger? The hole's larger. Um, Look at this one. But it's, it's, exactly the same technique it's just that when you start off and wrap around you wrap around the five rather than the three same item on sale on another website for 30 pounds 99 Yvonne I thank you uh, there you <laughs> go that proves our point 30 pounds how can you charge 30 pounds and 99 pence a bit of water with a bit of metal in it mm. Maybe theirs is made of diamonds. I don't know. Uh, thank you very much. Yvonne in, uh, in Lancashire. Where are you in Lancashire? I'm popping up in the next couple of weeks. I'm going to get Drew some berry black pudding for when he comes home from New Zealand. Even though they do deliver now, but I can go and see me now. Hi, Dink, if you're watching. How are you doing, darling? You all right? Should be fine. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> apparently, loads of people get nostalgic about this tool. Uh, morning, Lucy and all the JM. Your knitting spool has brought back memories from when my nan taught me how to do corking. And that's from uh, Nelly. Oh, hun, all these little memories. I remember, I remember learning to crochet, hmm. sat on the worktop of my friend Janine's grandma's house. That's how I learned to crochet. Hi, Lucy, living the morning as usual. I got these spools last year and made loads of bracelets for my son last year. He took them to the um, burning man festival to give away i don't know what that is uh to, to uh give away his friendship bracelets that's just fab because it is so stupidly cost effective uh, i made a lovely necklace and bracelet i used 0.6 wire and gems five pin for necklace three pin for bracelet effect is amazing from shirley and reddit shirley thank you so much for that that's obviously, a good point yeah <laughs> five for necklace three for bracelets get <clears throat> both of them can i just say at this point what janet Thank you so much. You have literally, you were thrown in at the deep end. Live TV. Here's a tool you've never used before. Come and make us some jewellery, as you did. But so. it just shows how easy it is to use. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Loads of you buying this one as well. So just suggested there a five prong one for necklaces, three prong one for bracelets. Somebody else has found it on a website for £30.99 pence for one. I really don't understand that. Hey, we're wicked. We're going to do the five prong one for the same price at twelve ninety five. In the words of producer Kim, boom. <laughs> I've told you, my little boy Charlie is now saying boom. Charlie, should we go in your car? And I dangle him and he goes, boom, and boom. <laughs> As a game, I'm not actually chucking him in his cot. <laughs> Good. All uh, right, 12 at 95, EIBD26. Can you tell him I'm absolutely obsessed? Hello, what's it? What, what's, it, what's they trying to tell me? Mm. What? <laughs> Is it a book? I'm 
I'm chatting. I think Debbie's coming to. I have explain. no idea. This is Debbie Bulford. There's well, that's Laura Binding there. Ah. I talk with Can my hands. I could be an air hostess. <laughs> yes. Here, here, and here. Um, Debbie Bulford, why was I talking about you earlier? Tumbling why stones. did I mention Deb? Pardon? Tumbling, tumbling stones. stones. Is your husband still tumbling stones? Yeah. We've got a ruby strand. Let me just hang on. Um, <laughs> Bulford. 95 carats, ruby. Guess how much? Oh, yeah. Guess how much? Oh, Can I can't. You Go I can't. On. Oh, I don't, don't know. 35, 7, 40 pounds, 40 plus? Right? <laughs> 6.95, 6.95. <Yeah. 95. laughs> yeah, so I was saying, if you've got a tumbler. Excuse me. Yeah, you could tumble those. How, so what have you just done to it know just, if you can You can just them? see the colour come through when you, when you rub it. So all you did was, you basically just licked, licked my it. rubies. Sorry. <laughs> well, you kiss them. <laughs> Don't kiss it now. I haven't licked them. Me. That's a whole different yeah. ballgame. That would be, um, yes. Anyway. <laughs> Yes, you can tumble, I think. Would anyone like this? Debbie Bulford's licked it. Some people <laughs> will <laughs> pay a fortune for that now, Debbie Bulford. Sterilise that before you send it out. I'll put some antibacterial hand wash on it before we send it out. Uh, right. Bye. 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 Um, and we've got another one in here from, uh, I remember doing this at school, it was called French knitting. We made all sorts of things with the braids, including, including <laughs> slippers. I tell you. I keep thinking there's a label stuck under my top because you can see that image there and there's the instructions there. Anyway. <laughs> Hi Lucy, you can twist the finished braid into flower shapes and sew into place. Linda and Hastings, you, you guys are amazing. Now, endless possibilities. Someone else has found it on a website for £30.99. pence. We've done, got the five prong here for £12.95. We've got the three prong for £12.95. Hi Lucy, you can twist the finished braid. Oh no, we've just had that one, sorry. Um, we'll get another one loaded in a minute. Pardon? The text facility has just gone all weird, Kim just said. She's just sorting it out. With sari silks? Yes. <gasps> that would be fabulous. Imagine the effect you would get with all the different colours and the little bits of gold thread and things that you get through mm. them. Oh, I'm it. loving it. I'm loving it. Loving the knitting tool. I use something like this um, as a kid. Brings back memories. It's great with sari silk threads and also the wire. It makes lovely braids. Carol, thank you for texting in this. So for anyone who's never used one before, I, I swear I've never used one. No, I really don't think I ever have. I'm trying to think back now to when I was a child if perhaps I used one. No, they're fabulous. This is going to be, yeah, because I can do that when I'm in bed. I love making jewellery in bed. It's my only time I chill out. I need to wind down. But it's really relaxing because you're just sort of uh, repeating the pattern. It's, it's yeah, quite it easy to do. Oh, hello. What's going on? Right. I am absolutely gutted, can I just say. I am not presenting the next strand. I'm about to pass you over now just in case you've just tuned in i'm not ill i haven't fainted i haven't needed to rush out to the loo or anything but i'm not presenting the next item i really really think we need to get you your own theme tune it's mike's moments hello <laughs> how are you um i'm gonna sell a lovely aquamarine strand today it's not just um in a standard stone, it's actually aquamarine nuggets, and you can see it here on a wide shot. It's quite long, as you can see, it's like a double strand actually. So, um, yeah, you know, you're getting a lot on here because, um, you know, if you separate this out, um, if you were to cut this uh, strand and separate it out, think of all the different uh, gemstones you're getting on here. I've been uh, just told it's 75 centimeters, so you know, that is a decent length strand right there um, as I say a double really um, well, the thing with aquamarine the reason I like it is because it's very pale in colour but it's still blue and blue is my favourite colour so things like aquamarine tanzanite for me are like the best uh, the best that you can buy this I think matches three of the four seasons uh, spring summer and winter because I think with spring um, you certainly, you know, you think of blues, you think of like the new flowers coming out. Summer, obviously, beaches, sun, sea. 
and um, I'm just going to pop it against the black background and finish my thought. The final thing I was going to say was winter. Obviously, you got the icy, yeah, the icy blues, the icicles, the snow. So I think you know most seasons you're going to be, uh, you know, you're going to, you can't go wrong with it. Is basically what I'm saying. <laughs> kind of uh, muddling my words a little bit there, but um, yeah, I think you know you you can make this work for a lot of seasons. If you're a designer, obviously that's good for your sales. But if you're just making it up for yourself, then um, you can wear it out pretty much any time of the year. The only reason I wouldn't say autumn is because it's generally kind of, you're thinking more browns and uh, and stuff in the autumn. But every other season it works. Anyway, as I was, as I was saying earlier, it's a long strand. It's uh, a double strand pretty much. It goes very far. You can put this in rings. Um, you could strand it into rings, but mostly I'd say it works for neck pieces. They, um, to, to the touch, they feel, Pretty pretty smooth, I'd say. Um, and as I say, this this means that they work in the neck pieces very well. Okay. One other thing I want to say is I think this would work really well with uh, perhaps a silver wire or thread. Um, I'm going to hold it against the black uh, background one more time. Okay. Just being told as well, a little key fact. That this is one of the top five gemstones so you've got your ruby emerald sapphire and diamond and then you've got the uh, aquamarine and of course we've just come out of March um, but it's worth noting this is March's birthstone so you know that's pretty good if you've got a relative in March and uh, who has a birthday and you're looking to make a piece for them um, Again, tying in with the spring theme. Okay, I feel like we're ready for the price. Um, so we're gonna bring that in any second now. Six pounds and 95 pence. A brilliant price because look at how much you get. Um, for less than seven pounds, 130 carats, 75 uh, centimeter strand and for less than seven pounds. And you know, we wouldn't really ca count these as in separate gemstones like perhaps we would with uh, like, I don't know, six or seven piece gemstone strand, but this has a lot um, of nuggets in there that you could, as I said, use for neck pieces, use, you know, for bracelets because these would go really well with stretchy bracelets and earrings as well. Um, and also, uh, Kim just mentioned something that was, I thought, a very, a very good shout. Um, I, I, it's kind of just gone out of my mind because I'm chips and nuggets DVDs. That's it. Match it up with this. So if you're not, you know, particularly sure how you want to use these, pick that chips and nuggets DVD up from the call center, and you can use it alongside this. And remember that, you know, it's the the one time postage and packing. You can use it. Uh, doesn't matter how much you're ordering in a day. It's the same price of two ninety-five, I believe. Is that right? Yeah. Excellent. We're going to go to a short break now. Um, thanks for uh, listening to me. And um, here we go. I'll throw out to a break. <laughs> Strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order for just 50p and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from the Genuine Gemstone Company. And thank you very much to Mike for giving me time to have my cup of tea. Um, that was amazing. Six ninety-five on that aquamarine strand. Six ninety-five. Let's just get perspective for a moment. It's aquamarine. It's genuine aquamarine. Uh, Julie, morning all. Lucy, I think you're out of a job. Julie, I think you're right. Mm -hmm. I just what was really lovely though is every time I've listened to Mike presenting, brilliant, loving Mike's moment. Um, that's from Edwina in Devon. I, he always teaches me something. Isn't that really nice? 
That's ace. Yeah, the student becomes the teacher. The student becomes the teacher. Do you feel like a student of mine, Mike? I've learned from you. You've learned from me. But like I said, you I could present do very it, differently. But That's very telling. You couldn't do the four hours. Now you do it for four hours. We just chill out and have a giggle. Yeah. That's ace. I love it. You're more relaxed, I think. I have been doing it for a number of years. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll get you doing some more moments though. Mike's moment. Now, the next thing I want to do is I want to ask you to text in ideas of soundtracks that we can have for Mike because we've had a little moment so far today talking about soundtracks. I'm thinking something a bit like Indiana Jones um, or a bit like Superman or something or maybe you can be a little bit more out there. Think of the piece of music. Obviously, we can't pay, play it for longer than eight seconds but we'd like to come up with a soundtrack for Mike's moment. Yeah? Fabulous. Right, we're going to go to our next kit and again, we're going to be going stupidly low on the price of it. Janet, this is a beautiful kit. The colours are so rich. The colours were absolutely beautiful. And to have the, the cord in there as well um, was just amazing. But they are so rich and so earthy and just this beautiful. Necklace. This necklace. This necklace. And the, the particular tone of the antique bronze bindings works Perfectly. so well, so perfectly. So let's first of all look at this one here. Now, interestingly enough, Janet's done something that I thought I'd probably do and use the S class. You've actually pitted them together and used them as a connector. Yeah. They're lovely. They're really, really lovely. Look at this almost sort of heart like in its design. Big, 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 rich, rich, juicy colours. Now, I know we've had pollution lately. That's attractive. But my word, hasn't the Sahara pollution and the Sahara sand and all that Ujamaa have given us some incredible sunsets absolutely incredible sunsets and for me this almost has a sun oh it's called sunrise yeah. sunrise sunset either way really um some beautiful sun tones it's got a, a real it's got a warmth to it it's got a real real warmth to it now interestingly enough since the kit was sent to Janet we've actually put in an extra free gift in here as well so Janet didn't have the um, unikite which was measuring is that right is that oh. supposed to be in this kit yeah the unikite yes it is the extra free sorry gift. I did you did there it is I forgot <laughs> yes she did she's totally <laughs> forgotten she had let me just right. get the I thought the jewellery hadn't been made because that sometimes happens that a kit I got gets kit a changed up. slightly between it being <clears throat> sent. There we go. There we go. Oh my word, there's a whole other suite of jewellery. There. there we go. Oh, look at that green. Now, you've got thread coming out of your ears in this as well. So I do think if you've got the knitting tool that we've just had or the braiding tool, the five spool, the five peg, what are we calling them? We are calling it a knitting spool, fabulous. Um, if you've got that, this is going to be a great kit because particularly with the size five, um, sorry, the, the five prong, you could use the larger beads, you could put the, through it and obviously think about the bead loom we'll have on the show tomorrow. You've got different satin cords. Now look at that unikite in there. That's gorgeous. Then this piece here, again with the green thread, the value for money on this kit is going to be incredible. You've got red agate, Brazilian red agate in here as well. This. Just to let you know, oh, go on, Kim, get the price down then. Go on, go on. Oh, you little minx. She's already done it. Just so you know, the price of the gemstones alone is 16 95 For two pounds today, you can get all of the findings, all your threading materials, and we're gonna give you all your satin calls for free. Free phone number 0800 644 645, eight pounds and 95 pence. Should be 36 pounds and, and 15 pence. 36 pounds, 15, 18 95 so. For me, the big, big wow factor is this one here um, with the amount of gemstones, wow factor. But then you've got, it's just love, oh, so much, there's so much going on here. In terms of the gemstones, they are beautiful. Have a look further down. Every single finding that you see, everything that Janet has used, included in this kit, <gasps> it's flying out. And you've got, oh, my word, oh, my word, oh, my word. We're gonna, right, we're gonna sell out. So you've got the rope style individual spaces in there as well they're like a jump ring but they're rope style they were beautifully all of these are genuine gemstones that piece of jewelry is exquisite using all the head pins to create this gorgeous rosary style chain up to the connector at the back you're going to get absolutely loads you do actually get a meter of chain so you must have had some chain left over as well yeah. the chain i threaded the chain through oh no the, wow uh, through that little and that, that is simply is gorgeous <clears throat> that is just simply a chain stitch you can actually do that on your finger a chain stitch wow just a simple simple chain stitch that's amazing so you've threaded the chain through that through goodness me I hadn't looked at that in detail that is stunning that is really stunning really stunning um, 
Look at this brooch. All, the only thing that Janet's added to this kit is literally a safety pin on the back of there. Fabulous! I adore that. Can you imagine wearing a cream top and then having that as a bracelet and that's a necklace? Oh. I think that sort of jewellery, if you're going on holiday, if you're going camping or something, um, yeah. just to take some light jewellery that you know you can just throw in a bag, you're going to a festival or something, just throw that in yeah. a bag and it's yeah, ready yeah, to yeah. use. Definitely, and especially with this one here, you know, long style maxi dress, one that you can just wrap up ideally a crinkle one so you don't have to think about ironing it. Uh, wrap that up with it as well. That's just gorgeous. A real summertime feel to it. So in terms of the gemstones you're getting, great kit, less than 20 pounds, over half the socks now gone. Um, you've got these amazing three strands. So in terms of sizes, let me get these sizes for you. You've got, Now then, I thought that was Unikite, but it's coming up as Epidote. I'm not familiar with that terminology. Can we just find out if that's within the same family? I think it actually might be a different name for it. We're going to get Hannah Roxbury on the phone, who's our in-house gemologist, who's currently sat upstairs in the office, so she can help us. Um, and then you've got the most amazing agates in those really, really rich colours of the 8 mil. Um, it's a really deep, intense berry red, that one's beautiful. TV screen's not doing that justice at all. And then you've got these fabulous agates, further agates, which are... La, 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 la. Why can't I find the measurements? Oh, I tell you, we really need to sort out my screen. Uh, yeah, 10 millimetres in diameter. Uh, 34 centimetre strands on this one, 38 centimetre strand on this one, and uh, 38 centimetre strand. So 38 and 38 centimetres, 34 centimetres on that one. They are gorgeous, really, really, really lovely colours. We're just going to confirm that gemstone for you. 18.95. Yeah, we're just researching it for you because Hannah's not at a desk at the moment, so... Oh, okay. Because um, Unikite is known as a collective gemstone which has got different mineral properties in it, one of the mineral properties very present in Unikite is Epidote, and this has been named as an Epidote. So, personally, for me, as soon as I saw that, I thought Unikite. So, I would say if you want Unikite to go with Unikite, you can definitely use that. It's part of the same mineral groups. Well, the mineral properties found within Unikite is that in its pure form. Amazing. So what technique are you going to show us? I think we're going to show the <coughs> excuse me, the necklace that you liked, the heart shaped I love it. section at the front. We're I don't even think that. I got a chance to show the earrings as well. They're just, oh, I love this, absolutely love it. Can we just have a look at the findings again, please, Claire? Because we have so many different findings packed. This is 100 findings. So is it 100 or 115, this one? Hundred and fifteen, well, hundred and fourteen. Hundred and fourteen findings and a metre of chain. So you get your metre of chain, you've got two different styles. Toggle clasps, you can see the jump rings and the rope style, you've got forty-five head pins, uh, thirty are round nose, uh, sorry, round wall head pins, uh, fifteen are flat. Then you've got your cord, ribbon cord extender chain, so the S clasp, you've got the um, three pairs of shepherd hooks two with the sort of spring style on them and then a very simple plain pair. Then you've got all of those um, crimpy, crimpy covers and jump rings, 18.95. Loads of you getting this one. So we're going to learn how to do this one here. Okay. Okay, can I just put that there? Of course you can. Okay, so um, what we need to do is, is just sort of make a flower of the beads, which I know is sort of like an easy technique. So you've got five beads onto your thread and then go back through the f that first bead. So to try and keep it central, what I would do is use a really long section and then carry on up the neck, um, use one continuous piece. So how much do you think you'd need? Um, I'd, probably, I'd probably say take a metre off, because you've got you, lots. You get 50 metres, you'll be fine. So there's plenty there to, to play with. So then just pull that so you've got that flower section and that essentially is the, the centre part of there. Okay. And then what we're going to do then is just recreate that a couple of times either side. So if we add on, um, there we go. There, so if we add on three on this side, three on the outside and one on the center, on the inside section. And then take the wire from this inside section back through the last bead that you've put on on this outside. 
No, I didn't do it like that, did I? I used two sections. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Nice TV. Yes. Is anyone texting the theme tune for Mike yet? Quite a few. We'll have a look at those in a minute. Mike, are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> can I just have a look at that? Sorry. Um, yes, of course you can. Sorry, my dear. I think what I did is I put a second section through. The thing is, it's, it's a while since you make them. And yeah. You sort of lose your thread, really. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yes. Okay. Ignore me. Right. So I was right the first time. Then, so we put one on that side. Sorry, you start to doubt yourself. Which is silly. There you go. And then put that through. You're only human. Yes. Flesh and blood. A woman. <laughs> there you go. So you go through there. So you then pull those. We do it again. Sorry, everybody. I'm having a senior moment. <laughs> there we go. So pull that, and you've got that section there. Mm -hmm. So that's then the start of that side. And then what I did is I'll cut that down a bit because I don't want to strangle anybody with with all of that thread. Then what I did is I threaded another section through this one here. So then we've got the thread then to continue that side. Mm -hmm. Right, so we've got that one, and then on this side, if we put one on the outside, and then two more on this side, there we go, so we've got four there, if we put another one on this side, depending on which side that you put them on, it is dependent on the angle that you're going to get. If you put it, the three on the one side, the flower is going to lean more towards that side. So then put the um, thread through that bead and just repeat that process. There you go. So there. So you've got that that flower shape. And then you just do exactly the same. Do you want me to, shall I do the other side or shall I just completely do this one section? Let's do the other side, shall we? Quickly, if we can. There we go. Two. There's still a little bit of stock left on the kit at 18.95. Remember, that's a full finest pack in there for 18.95. The beads alone are 16.95. It's a bargain. You get all of those threads as well. That gorgeous green, the satin, and the peach, the red, and the orange as well. Really gorgeous luxury. Luxury. That's like a Tudor red. The, the cords are absolutely beautiful mm. to work with. They're very forgiving as well. I found when I because I use them a lot. Um, for macrame and yep. if you go wrong you can undo them very easily That's very good there you go so that one what I did with this one I put the extra two on the outside so it's it's a bit more open mm -hmm. than, than it would be okay um, so that that's essentially the actual um, design beautiful so then what we do is all I did then was bring those two together bring those two cords together and then you bead up. And then I started beading up with the with the larger stones. And it's as simple as that. As that. And then all I did is pull that really tight against there, used um, the lovely little um, round jump rings. These the ropes are they're yeah. lovely, aren't they? And I adore this necklace. And then just go just go along um, with those as many as you want, and then crimp onto the little S. And if you actually wrap that around and crimp onto that, the little ball on the end of that will stop the beading thread from coming off. Oh, okay. So if you do that really tightly onto there, it's not going to come off. Yeah. And you can just pincer it together to make sure it's nice and close so uh, it can't un come off. Yeah. And, and, well. and that's it then. It's, it's, it's simply, that is the section. And then, and you're then beading. you just, just bead up. And it's simple beading then, attach that. And then um, the rosary star chain is simply just head pins with the beads on um, and then just attach those or you could just continue beading all the way around lovely you can do it however you want really really lovely thank you so much right goodness me um gosh there's, there's loads going on that that is going really really quickly we had a good quantity in stock let's just get myself organized again have me wires let's scoot this way um because what would work really nicely is copper wire with that now we've got a brand new bundle 
that is going to ridiculous offer and it's going to be amazing. Now, point six is our absolute most requested size. And I think it's because this gauge of wire, you can do anything with. You can use it um, to create your own findings. It's a good gauge to go through piercings for ears. Um, it's a good gauge to, to hold strength. You can hammer it, you can manipulate it. So for me, when people ask, I'm, gonna, I'm only gonna have one reel of wire, I'm gonna have one gauge, what would you recommend? Always say a 0.6, I always say a 0.6. Because it's also malleable enough that if you wanna do it and you want to get a thicker gauge, so say a 1.2, it's malleable enough to go in a wire twisting tool so you can gain that extra gauge from it as well so you pretty much other than very fine weaving where you'd probably use a 0.4 or 0.25 you can pretty much do anything with a 0.6 can't you yeah i think for me if i could only have one gauge of wire it would be a 0.6 yes definitely because you can make findings sorry. sorry you can make findings as well out of it earring findings so it's really really um the most versatile, versatile. absolutely 100 meters now any of our professional wire workers always buy it by the 100 meters because it's the most cost effective way to do it today however is cost effective and a boom extra uh, from kimbo a uh, boom extra this is um this is copper color it works i can't tell you how amazingly it works with rose gold and we are literally going to be we're about 15 minutes away a bit more 15 20 minutes away from our trade offer on rose gold color findings on 95 selling silver and the rose gold works so beautifully with it copper is again our fastest selling color uh, of wire so i would urge you to be as quick as you can we've got an incredible offer for you here and the offer that you're getting combines it with the sparkle suede now the sparkle suede is in this is the metallics so you're gonna get two packs of them. So you can get two lots of the um, uh, gold color, two, sorry, two reels of the silver color and two reels of the bronze. Now you can see it's the suede, but you have actually got a sparkle on it. A really, really lovely, lovely, lovely sparkle on the surface layer at the top part of the suede. Now you're going to get 30 meters in total. There's five meters on each reel, five continual meters. Now, obviously, you can also use these with the knitting spool. That'd look fabulous. Wouldn't it? With the sparkle with as well. With the sparkle on it, that would be great. Oh, am I right in thinking? Could you get the five prong knitting spool but only use three of them? Um, yeah, I don't see why not. You'd get a different Because I'm effect. just thinking you've got you've got a larger hole. You'd get a different look again, wouldn't you? But you've got a larger hole, so it would be really interesting to use the leather and then maybe sorry, the suede. All right, so 30 meters and you point six, a hundred meters of 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 point six. <laughs> now you should be paying thirty-one pounds eighty. You should be paying £31.80. 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 How much should you be paying, Mike? Should be paying £31.80. £31.80. Amelia, how yeah. much should you be paying? £31.80. Janet, how much should everyone be paying? Oh, I think about thirty-one eighty. You're right. You are actually right thinking that. Should we? Uh, should we do something that everyone's actually going to be paying today? Because it's amazing. You need yeah. this in your life for nineteen ninety-five. How many complaints am I going to have today? I wish it'd stop singing. <laughs> I had to tune out. My ears are bleeding. My cats are crying. Nineteen ninety-five. Oh, eight hundred six double four six double five. Um, amazing, 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 amazing. Less than twenty pounds to get that anywhere for less than thirty pounds would just—it's just mind-boggling. We're doing it for less than twenty, but it's only a great price if you're taking advantage of it. Congratulations! I've got. Do you know what I'm really excited about today? We've got people from all over the world today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mike had uh, somebody shopping in Denmark. Celine, hello to you. Would you like a hand delivery? Shall we bring this out to you and have a little holiday? That'd be quite nice, wouldn't it? That'd be quite nice. <laughs> Kim, I love how eloquent our producer is. I would <laughs> totes do that. You're so cool, Kimbo. Kim's had a very hard weekend this weekend. She's very tired today. Mm. 
<laughs> what have you been? <laughs> she's been on a little holiday. She's not had a hard weekend in the slightest. She's been gallivanting. She's had a great time. Uh, 1995. Uh, now then, Mike, you've got fun mail coming in. Okay. Here we go. Theme tunes for Mike. Mike's moment theme tune. <laughs> Jaws from Linda in Hastings. I'm loving it. Is there a more of a theme tune? <laughs> Paula, hi Lucy and the gang. How about Simply the Best by Tina Turner for Mike's moment? Oh, Paul's, Paula's nice. Yeah, that one, I, I didn't quite like, well, I didn't think I understood the Jaws one. You it didn't understand the like, Jaws one? I think like it's a, more as a warning sound, yeah, darling. It's like, look who is on screen change yeah, the channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> look who is on screen change the channel. I don't think so, darling. Look, look. And another one, hi all, Mike deserves an original soundtrack. Get Ollie and his band to compose one. Great show as always from uh, Aileen. Thank you, darling. Um, brilliant, brilliant. Hi Lucy, don't ever change. You brighten people's days and that's amazing. <laughs> Thank you, lovely. <laughs> Thank you so much, that was really ace. Can I just tell you, I'm really excited because I know that I've changed two lives. I got told about it yesterday. Uh, I haven't seen it for myself, but apparently, yesterday during the show, I had two kittens after me on the telly. Oh, I saw the photograph. I haven't seen it. Oh, yet. It's, oh, oh it's amazing. Apparently, they were like. <laughs> so, to those little kittens. Amelia's worried she's got competition. Talking about competitions, let's go to the Wall of Fame. You are daft. Got did it, did it, did it, did it, going around in my head now. I'm thinking, um, keep them coming in. Ideas for Mike's theme tune, but I do like the idea of Ollie and his band creating an original because if Ollie signs it over, we don't have to stick to just the eight seconds and we could have the music playing throughout the whole of your presentation. How do you feel about that, Mike? You're excited, I can tell. Let's move on. <laughs> now, for oh, oh that's pretty. isn't this beautiful? Stacey in Bedford. Um, Hi all at JM, I haven't sent anything into the Wall of Fame for a while and I made these sets of jewellery for my bridesmaids as I'm getting married on the 21st of June, congratulations. Um, the gemstones are using red garnet with clear quartz drops and gold plated sterling silver findings, all from JM of course. I sent a Mother's Day message to thank my mum for all her help and Lucy asked about my wedding cake. It's three tiers of Victor, oh check it out, oh why am I in this cave on that? Three tiers <laughs> of Victoria sponge, mm. chocolate and lemon sponge and will be a custom made theme cake. I'll send a photo to Lucy after the wedding. Good luck to everyone. Oh, Stacy, I totally remember your message now. Um, that is beautiful. How sentimental to have it for such a the most important day of your life. Um, congratulations, 434, and I look forward to see <coughs> receiving your cake. Thank you. <laughs> By June, I'll be well on the road to my Half marathon training, maybe if I've had my foot operation. I'm doing half a marathon. What am I doing? Brave. That for? I know. I've got to do it. Right. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my word. Oh my I word. Love all this detail. <gasps> and the chain. I love it. And the chain wiggling. This is fab. And using the wax wire cone. Love that. This is 435. Um, and it's my kind of thing with the chain. Just beautiful. I love the way you went with that chain in the previous I, piece. I love doing that with yeah. the chain. And, um, and this is from Alan. It's from Alan. Uh, yes. And I think it was meant sort of uh, based on yesterday, on Sunday. It says, good morning, JM Chocolatiers. <laughs> Hope you're all well and ready for the chalk. <laughs> I started yeah. making jewellery in February this year. And after buying bundle after bundle, then the hammer and block, then the wags wire cone, I still had all these chipping screaming at me, use us, use us. So I gave in and with a combination of three styles, I love and I've learnt from your fabulous designers. Here it is, my first ever market stall, a centrepiece. Happy Sunday to you all. May the cake be dripping in chalk. Hugs always. Alan from Wakey. Is it Wakey? Wakey, London. 
Do you spend your time between Wakefield and London, I'm wondering? Mm. And it says, P.S. I'm trying to get on the Sunday experience and I'm a qualified chef, so the cakes will be with Alan, me. Alan, <laughs> you're in. Alan, right. <laughs> Do me a favour because I'm going to start, once I'm well on my way with this training, I'm going to start allowing myself to have one treat a week and I'm going to make it a Sunday experience week um, cake. Do me a favour, when you apply for your Sunday experience, please can I be on? Please can I be presenting? Please. Please. You'll find usually, um, yesterday, I, will, I don't usually do the Sunday yesterday, I do alternate Sundays and that would be of this coming Sunday. Except I'm not doing it because I haven't got childcare, which is why I did that last one. Because mum and dad are at a wedding, my mum has my little boy and my husband's in New Zealand. So, if you take next week as my usual week, alternate from that, that's when I'll be on. Please come in. Oh, yeah. I'm That'd excited. Be good. I'm excited because your jewellery is amazing. That is fabulous. It's it? really fab, fab design. Uh, 435 and then 436. Look at this. Gorgeous. This is from Elizabeth in Northern Ireland. Hello, lovely. Good morning, all at JM. This is my entry to the Wall of Fame. I saw Debbie Kershaw doing this technique a few weeks ago on the morning show, and it's lovely. That is lovely. I used moo kite and tiger's eye beads that I bought in a kit in January. Good luck to all in the draw, and thanks for the great shows. Best wishes from Elizabeth Burke in Northern Ireland. Elizabeth, that is beautiful. Really classy. Four, three, six. Good luck. And this is four, three, seven. How beautiful, lovely is that isn't it? this time of year? Gorgeous. Zesty. Springy colours. This is from Christina in Salisbury. And Christina says, hello, JM. Hello. This week's entry was made with green fire agate and smoky quartz, which are two colours which I think go so well together. I agree, I think they're beautiful. I also used a mix of gold and copper findings, which is something I don't usually do, but it works in this case. And that's regards from Christina. That is absolutely beautiful, isn't it? This wire and the flower effects, it's just gorgeous. And the green is lovely. Really gorgeous, really gorgeous. Like Good that. luck. And then the final one for now, wow. Four, three, eight. This is from Roz in Edinburgh. My entry to the Wall of Fame is a simple pair of earrings made with large Labradorite nuggets, which is a magnificent rainbow colours, and all the materials are from JM from Roz. Love to all, she says. Roz, they're stunning. Four, three, eight. Good camera work as well to get that. To get shiller. the shiller. That's yeah, fabulous. yeah, we hardly ever see it on camera. Good luck there, hun, and you are four, three, eight. Right, okay. Coming up in about an hour's time, we've got the natural emerald. Unfortunately, we haven't got a huge quantity due to the nature of the gemstone, but I'll tell you more about that as we come to it. But also, coming straight up after the break, and if you've ever experienced one of our trade shows, you know the sort of prices that we do when it's buying in bulk and getting ridiculous trade prices. We're going to do a trade offer on 925 Stunning Silver, Rose Gold Overlay Pieces, um, Massive Findings Pack, Four Findings Packs, Massive Trade Offer, First Come First Serve Basis, be on the phone lines as soon as we come back from the break, it's going to sell out, the saving will be magnificent, we'll see you for that literally after this. <laughs> The Jewellery Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewellery designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Get making and good luck! You can now keep in touch by liking Jewelry Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced Jewelry Maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. You can now watch clips from Jewelry Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. When shopping with Jewelry Maker, you can add as many items to your order in one day and only pay one postage and packaging charge. We have two delivery options. Standard delivery at just £2.95 and you'll receive your parcel within four to six days. 
or opt for our premium delivery at just £4.95 and you'll receive your parcel within three to four days. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. You can now keep in touch by following Jewellery Maker on Twitter. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. I love doing offers like this because I think, let's be realistic, life is getting expensive out there. Even the price of a loaf of bread is going up. Um, so when you, when you get the chance to think about what finance you're going to use, probably 925 sterling silver isn't necessarily on the top of your list because of the price. We're about to do an offer that is out of this world outstanding. Now you're going to get four packs of incredibly, incredibly, incredibly beautiful 95 sterling silver rose gold plated findings. They're plated, okay? There are 95 sterling silver base metal with then a nine carat minimum rose gold overlay. Uh, sorry, plate on the here. Um, please, 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 if you're interested, even before the price comes in, be on the phone line and as soon as the price comes in you press your option one it's free to phone us if you are thinking about getting this offer phone now put this in your basket now because the opportunity that is about to come your way is a trade offer you're bulk buying for a trade offer offer we are already experiencing a 30 second queue on the phone lines get on the phone lines and press your option one now now they are absolutely beautiful you've just seen a bit of an overview there actually i think we've got a closer image as well um okay there you go there you go um, a lot of people have put this in their basket now they are precious 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 925 sterling silver i want to show you these through in detail there you go when I have a look at jewellery, um, particularly earrings, one thing that I really love to see, I don't know about you, but one thing I love to see on Shepherd Hooks is where it goes flush. Can you see? You've just got the 925 on there. Can you see the shape of it? Pure, utter elegance. Now, the other day, I was in a very... Um, a very known, it's not a high street, it's not locally, it's known, bead shop. And with 925 sterling silver um, shepherd hooks, 925 sterling silver shepherd hooks, they were three pounds a pair. Quite good. Nowhere near as good as here. Quite good, considering they're an independent store. And what I love is, we're actually, if you are an independent store buying from us, you will know that this is a trade price. So chances are you'll get this offer and then sell on individually. And if you want to do that, you'll make, you could potentially make masses. Because say there were three pounds a pair, you're going to be getting two, uh, you're going to be getting eight pairs of shepherd hooks. All right, you're starting to tot up. Eight pairs of shepherd hooks at three pounds a pair. You might find them more expensive in other places. You might find them cheaper in other places. I found them for three pounds a pair. Let me know what you've experienced elsewhere. Um, so 925 sterling silver with a nine carat rose gold plating. If you can possibly afford to get more than one of these offers, goodness me, we are busy. Right, the next wow factor and definitely, if you're using gemstone strands of distinction, remember this is going to be a trade offer. You might not use these for a year. You'll have them in your stash and save them for the precious pieces. Rose gold goes with everything. Rose gold is so hugely in demand at the moment. Rose gold is being seen in some of the world's biggest designers. 50 of this offer has already gone before we even brought the price in. Now look at this. This is where you get really get value for money because each one of your four packs, they'll all be the same, holds this stunning, stunning, stunning chain. It is so beautiful. Have you seen the price of just a plain silver chain? Have you seen the price of 925 sterling silver chain? Well, this has got obviously your rose gold plating on there on a 925 sterling silver chain. If you have not yet checked out of your basket, checked out of your baskets, check your baskets out. Do it now, that's six inches. Beautiful. The great thing is though, 
How many if you've got, oh, that's six inches, I probably need one of those. You're going to get four. You're going to get four. You're going to get 20, six, four, 24, yeah? Uh, you're going to get 24 inches. Do you know what I might have to do? I might have to lay a few more of these out. They're just beautiful. So there are two here. You're going to be getting everything that you can see on your screen. Everything you see on your screen. This is going to be a trade price for four packs of 925 sterling silver. This is where opportunities like this, I get really proud of where I work. I'm really proud of what we can do. It's the buying power. You get, you get to take advantage of it. It's great. It's a win-win. Right, head pins really good size of head pins in terms of the thickness as well because you can actually make your own shepherd hooks am i right in thinking you can get 15 2 3 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13. yeah 15 so in fact you're going to be getting 60 60. now i think it's quite good to get perspective What's the length of these, please? What are they? Point four? Are they four? Forty-eight millimeters, I think they are. Forty millimeters. What's forty times sixty? Six fours, twenty. Two hundred and forty, isn't it? So two meters and four centimeters. Have I just got that right? Yeah. So it'll be two meters and forty, wouldn't it? Right, let's get perspective for a second. 2.4 metres of 925 sterling silver wire. Are we getting excited? E, that was a good point, wasn't it? That was a good point. You get 2.4 metres of sterling silver. I hope my maths is right. It is right, isn't it? 60, you get 60 at 0.4, well you get 60 at 4 centimetres. Right. Well yeah, 6 times right, 4 is 24, you have yeah. times it by the 10, you've got that. So Carol <laughs> Vorderman eat your heart out, seriously. <laughs> so you get the equivalent of 2.4 metres of 925 sterling silver, 9 carat rose gold plating on the top. Oh and just to add in, apparently our 9 carat rose gold plating isn't 9 carat rose gold plating. We actually think it's a much higher uh, carat weight, you're guaranteed minimum of 9 carat, so it actually gets better and worst case scenario it's 9 carat and it's just amazing. Um, okay, if we then have a look at these balls, what you can pay elsewhere for just one of these? Well, you're going to get 40 of them. Now, if I just get my tweezers, oh, actually, I don't need my tweezers, I'll pop them on a head pin. You can easily get a one mil satin cord through these. How often, oh, sorry, I'm, these are crimp bead covers. I do apologise, they're crimp bead covers. I'd use, them as, I'd use them as balls. I'd totally use those as balls. And I'd use them with some satin cord and do that endless you know i talk about it endlessly that bracelet design that you can make masses of money on right if you've just tuned in this is a trade off it's on a first come first serve basis mega 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 i'm going to carry on you've then got um jump rings how many jump rings are you going to get three jump rings crimp beads in each pack so you're going to get 12 obviously what you're seeing there isn't everything that you're seeing that's just an essence of it you're not getting that you're getting that <laughs> because that picture is just an essence so you can see an example of what you're going to be getting where have i just put that then where did that just go oh no what have i just dropped we'll move on and pretend that didn't happen i don't know where it just went um right toggle clasp beautiful this is 925. You are going to get a ridiculous price, which is why people are seriously bulk buying this offer. And I think if you're in the profession as well, particularly um, people who are buying like 10 of these at a time, chances are that you're buying them to sell them on as individual components. So you've got your 925 on here. I also think if you're going to sell your jewellery, it is lovely to have a finding that states, states your 925. And this states 925 on it so remember this is a trade offer 
How, how are we doing for on the phone lines there, Kim? Okay, they're good. We're answering your calls pretty much as soon as you call, uh, as you call in. Okay, you've then got all of your crimp bees. Now, the great thing is, because you're going to be getting 40 of them, you can use them as spacer bees as well. So, what I possibly do is I'd use my, my copper plated crimp beads as functionality and then pop the, um, the crimp bead on the top in the, the stone silver you're gonna get what you're seeing here you're getting four times over can we see the image again please thank you tom okay 0800 six double four six double five then the lobster claw clasp if you haven't yet confirmed your purchase do it now trade offer trade offer pardon okay we've got a lot of people with this sat in your basket just do it folks just go for it just go for it go for it go for it go for it this is a special, special, special offer. You've seen our trade shows. You need to be getting this right here, right now, right here, right now. Amazing. First come, first serve basis. Oh, my goodness me. Should be £59.80. Should be £59.80. What's happened to our graphics? It's okay. Uh, That's amazing. Now, 43 pieces times four. Yes, giving you... 2.4 meters of 925 sterling silver wire in terms of your head pins alone. Then you've also got 24 inches of 925 sterling silver nine carat rose gold overlaid chain. Could you get a 24 inch chain made up of that type of quality of material for the price we're gonna do four whole complete packs for? So let's get just perspective on that again. Four of these. Four of these chains will give you 24 inches of 925 sterling silver, nine carat rose gold. Could you buy a, a chain made up of those four? Obviously, you just need to use a little jump ring or something in between or um, attach the hearts together. But could you actually buy a chain? I mean, just a plain silver chain. You can pay anywhere between probably in the mid 20s upwards. That's just plain silver. This is 925 sterling silver, heart shaped, handmade, and nine carat rose gold on it. You just, it's, yeah, speechless. <laughs> In a word, uh, yeah. Are we starting to get perspective of price? You've then got all of your crimp beads. You've got all of your crimp bead covers. Probably wouldn't use the crimp bead as crimp beads. I'd probably use them as spacer beads because they're 925 cents. So what you're seeing there is just an essence of what you're getting. You'll get that isn't one complete findings pack. That's what you're getting. <laughs> now, I can tell you that we don't believe anywhere else can compete for the quality for these exact packs in price. Okay? This is an amazing pack. The chain, the amount, the length of silver, when you work out the equivalent of 2.4 meters, when you lay out all of your, um, your um, head pins, Lucy, words, the toggle clasps, you've got the 925 stating on there as well. What you're seeing, apart from, if I was just to put one of the chains on, what you're seeing here, you get four times over. It's pure 925 sterling silver with a nine carat rose gold overlay. Oh, we haven't even brought the price in. Let's do it. And um, free phone number 0800 644 655. Obviously, this is a trade price. It works out as 10 pounds back. Oh my goodness, amazing. Free phone number 0800 644 655. Amazing, amazing, absolutely amazing. Amazing, amazing, absolutely amazing. I tell you, I'm gonna have a lot of haters today. Those internet trolls are gonna have my back with my singing. No, the haters have stopped texting in because now they're attacking me on my Facebook page. No, just go away. <laughs> For, just go away. <laughs> if you don't like me, just go away. Uh, KG, KJGC94. You see, I used to never say anything about it, but now I think everyone has the right to reply if they're effectively being bullied. Yes. Yeah, woo! Here's to standing up for yourself, no matter where you are or what you're doing in your life. If people are not being nice, stand up for yourselves because you live once and there's more to life. Come on now, let's yeah. go. Yay! Yay. <laughs> go, Lucy. I'm actually going to be getting involved with a bullying campaign, adult bullying. 
there's a lot of it about and there's yeah tell me about it you get bullied into coming into work every day <laughs> bambi darling we need to have a chat you're fine right 40 pounds it's amazing it's amazing 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 um now obviously i do appreciate that that's not going to be in everyone's price budget we're going to do an amazing offer on a cup of a pack next and also though it's not just about affordability it's also desirability and what you're after and i absolutely use a whole mix of types of findings depending on what i'm doing so if i'm going to be doing a funky little um oh, chunky bracelet some chunky agates it's just for me to wear everyday basis i probably use copper findings absolutely or on the end of my macrame pieces which are a bit more daytime i think i definitely if it's going to be a gift for somebody um or if i'm selling I, and i've started to sell it a little bit more than i used to a little bit i haven't done one since just before christmas but um and it was amazing um but if i'm selling i like to be able to certainly put 925 sterling silver for ear wires i do, I do like to do that but also if you're using gemstones for a certain caliber like the emeralds that we've got coming up we've got emeralds coming up we've got emeralds coming up did you get the rubies by the way at 6.95 that debbie bulford licked where has that strand got oh is it sold out it's sold out sorry oh uh, the ruby the ruby 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 oh no go on <laughs> it was better first time should we do it again yeah. ruby 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 oh Sometimes just, don't you wish you were Amelia? Mm. <laughs> Mike's going, nah. Thank you very much. Now, which one did Debbie Bulford lick? Um, back to the ruby, 95 carats of ruby for 6 95 today. And um, we've got a few of those finding packs remaining. Uh, Amelia, for what I have done, I am truly sorry. You are forgiven. Thank you. But loads of people have got a right good bargain. Uh, there we go, the ruby. Now I'll just quickly talk you through it again. Thank you, doll. Um, really, really quickly. I haven't done that yet. What are you doing with it? Little minx. That's my dirty, What's that? That's my what dirty, is that? Dirty blue tack. Your dirty blue tack. <laughs> White tack. Tack tack. Blue tack's a yeah. isn't it? It's actually, it's actually white that's gone dirty, almost blue. Amazing. Lovely, fascinating story. Right. 6 95 These are completely natural rubies. They're amazing nuggets. Debbie literally licked her finger and put saliva on them, which was a beautiful moment, um, to just ensure us that you can tumble these and they're a matte finish, but if you want to highly polish them, there's different ways that you can go about it as well. So whether you could lacquer them in something, I'm not sure. Might be something to look into. Uh, but it's 6 95 amazing. Uh, if you've just tuned in, where have you been? Seriously now, come on, come on. I'm very aware that Debbie's saliva is on these rubies. Can we get some anti back? Can we get some anti back to Ariel, please? Lovely. Uh, right, also coming up an amazing double trouble offer on emeralds, rubies, and sapphires. Stunning. <gasps> beautiful, beautiful. Right. Um, okay, we're going to do a double trouble deal on copper findings. So, obviously, um, these are rose gold plated copper findings. Now, with copper, you're going to be paying, it's a completely different ball game. It's a different price point. You're going to be using them in different ways. All of our findings have got their place in jewellery making, and I love these. Also, there is the, the fact to think about, they're going to be a much lower price. Ah, uh, okay. Um, Mike, can I get a black ball, please? Thank you. The one that hasn't got the coffee mark on it that Jenny put on it would be ace, thanks. I don't know if it was Jenny, but I blame her for everything. <laughs> yeah. What did you say, Martha? It would have been. I bet it was. I bet it was. Yeah. I bet it was. If you ever see a nail varnish on the desk, now that's Cleary. <laughs> She's lovely. You just got to love her, though. You just want to get a little face and kiss it. Um, but she, um, she needs to stop going to the gym. She's got those legs that look like little tennis balls have been inserted in your calves. <laughs> It's the horse riding. It's the horse riding. Yeah. Between horse riding and mucking out pigs and, and doing all of that business and catching ducklings off a roof, she is one very perfectly shaped woman. So let's carry on. 
can't help but love her, can you? Right, let's have a look then at this findings pack. Now, some of you will be really familiar with this findings pack because it's quite typical of the packs that you uh, that you get in the in the kits. What's fun though is you do not often have the opportunity to buy them individually, and I do disagree with the way that these are um, advertised, marketed to you really, because they're. You're told it's 115 pieces. I've said it before, I'll say it again. I don't agree that this is 115 pieces. This is 100. How can you classify a meter of chain on the same level as a crimp bead? This is definitely 114 pieces and a meter of chain. Is it not? I prefer my classification as well, Kim. Maybe we should have a word with our sales manager. Oh, hello, Martha. Hello. <laughs> uh, 114 items and a metre of chain. This is not 100. How can you classify a metre of chain in the same level as a crimp bead? Well, it is one component. It is one component, but it's on a whole different level, isn't it? Viewers agree with me. Viewers agree with me. It's already flying out. So, we're going to do a mega offer on this. Okay, so... I, I, don't you think that's great for us as a channel as well? We can offer both price points and for what you're going to be wanting to use them with. So... I adore this toggle cloth so much. I know I keep going on about it. But within those 115, you get the metre of chain. You also get that big, chunky, chunky, chunky toggle clasp. Also, what's quite exciting are your extender chains because your extender chains are actually made up of masses of individual components brought together. So if I just talk to you about this one, um, you just get loads. There's 45 findings. There are, um, sorry, 45 um, head pins, 30 with the ball on the end, um, 15 of which are slightly slimmer than the others, and then you get 15 which are the flat head pins. Now, this, for example, this is classified as a single finding. Well, really, for me, that's one, two, three, four. <laughs> There's equivalent to four findings on a one finding there. Are you with me on that one? Definitely. Because in some places, you buy all of those bits individually. And I do tend to sort of split them. As we saw before, yeah. use the S clasp in one thing, the chain yeah. is something else, the ribbon end bits in, in another. Yeah. So you've got multi use on them, you know. And these ribbon end bits, I know I keep going on about it, but they are perfect for stamping. They are. You can use it as a blank. You can hammer it out and then use it as a blank. I know, great, because copper blanks, you can pay quite a lot. But if you flatten that out and then use that to then stamp onto, this is incredibly versatile. Now, what you're seeing here, the 115, oh, you're going to get that twice over. So really, you're going to get 120, uh, sorry, 228 and two meters of chain. Yeah. Do that again, Tom. Instead of getting that, ready, that, you're going to get that beast, yes. Oh, just oh. right lz gc32 mega offer mega findings offer usually 9.95 a pack boom 14.95 wow. for two buy one get one for a fiver why wouldn't you hate because at 9.95 it's incredibly competitive anyway 14.95 lz gc32 Free phone number 0800 Amazing, amazing, amazing offers once again here at Jewelry Maker. Um, congratulations to those of you who are joining us and getting the offers. Because, okay, about 45, I thought you said 45 minute queue. 45 second queue. So don't worry, if you come through, press your option one. As long as you come through to a recorded message, you're okay. If you come through to a, that means that we're really chucker on the phone lines and just call back again. But as long as you come through to a recorded message asking you to press your option one, do that and you'll come through and hopefully get it. I think I've run out of energy for the rest of the show. Mike, do you fancy another moment? What can I present? No. What can you present? Do you want to do another moment? I'll have to get my mic back out. So you'll have to get your mic back out. Maybe... You um, got so tired that you just really feel like you needed a break. Pardon? You've got me on backup now. See, that's... Yeah, if I'm that tired, I need a break. I've got you on backup. Break. Like if you're ill one day, for example. If I'm ill one day, you will you present the show? Like, not the whole show, but if you like want a moment. If I want a moment have a sip of water, to have a sip of water, it, how very five. gentlemanly of you. Yeah, take five. He can step in. One option, maybe. <laughs> if we had any more suggestions of Mike's soundtrack. Not at the moment. Lots of people texting in about how amazing this offer is. I know. I know. Uh, stock levels on that one, please, Kimberly. Okay, good. Uh, over 100 of those have gone, but we've got... Uh, we've got, still got good stock of that available at 14.95. Have I got any more banana left? Yeah. I'm on my caveman diet. I'm not allowed bananas. 
caveman. Basically, the whole point of the way I'm eating is I'm trying to, you cut out the rubbish, and I'm trying to eat in a really pure way. So I can't even have ketchup. I have been, I've been cheating with ketchup. I'm not supposed to be drinking tea either. I'm doing a variation, I'm just being really good. Basically, I'm not eating chocolate, <laughs> which I hadn't realized until I stopped eating it, how massive amount of my diet tea. that was. Gin. Green tea, yeah. Not a cup of tea though, is it green tea? It's good. Well, it's a cup of tea, obviously, and I don't want to be prejudiced against green tea. It's nice. It's not the same. It's not the same. If you need a brew, you need a brew, you need a brew. If someone said, I've made you a cup of tea and brought me, and I was like, oh yeah, and I've got all self psyched up. It's like when people say, oh, I've got, would you like a herbal tea? I'd have a herbal tea if I was desperate. But herbal tea, it just lacks that, doesn't it? What about decaf? Yeah, decaf, well I drank it the whole time I was pregnant. And now I'm sleep deprived, so I sort of need it. But still, I haven't found a really amazing tasting decaf no. tea. They do taste different. I'm glad we got that sorted, shall we move on? Let's go. <laughs> um. I've got sapphires, emeralds, and rubies in this show. Your sapphire is about to come up. Emeralds, we've done the ruby. Emeralds on its way. Okay, before I do this, Kim, just give me a breakdown, hun. Treatments on the sapphires. Totally natural. Okay. Um, they're genuine sapphires, and there will come a point very soon where we are no longer bringing you coloured sapphires. Is that all? Okay, we've got less than 100 of this offer. Is this the last of... Is this the last sapphire offer? This is the last time you're going to get the chance to buy this strand of sapphires. If this all sells out, it's gone. What have I been saying? What have I been saying? The way that we work here at Jewelry Maker, because I've said recently, I've been telling you, I think we've all been telling you about the concern that coloured sapphire it's becoming incredibly, incredibly difficult to get. And in fact, uh, over the last six months, very, very tiny, 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 tiny yeah. amounts have been mined of natural coloured sapphire. We bought this, uh, gosh, this must be coming up for a year ago now. Kim's just checking when the gemstone was bought to go to our workshops in Jaipur in India. Because the gemstone gets bought sometimes some of the jewellery on Gems TV and Rocks TV, um, the gems cones can get bought six to eight years in advance. Because what happens is Steve, who heads our gem hunting team, when he gets offered a package, a deal, he'll buy it and then not use it for years and years and years and years and years and years and years. And years. So, for example, um, he said there are some mines that stopped being in operation over 50 years ago for some gemstones and he is still being offered gemstones from those mines now. So what people do is when they know the mines are coming to end they'll bulk buy and then hold on to it and wait for the price to go up. You've got coloured sapphire. We're not going to be seeing it for a long time it's expected. There is slight concern that for some of the hues of sapphire, it's gone forever. There is some concern about some of the hues of some of the colours. Now this is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful strand. And today you're going to get two. Now they are completely natural. Of course, natural gemstone commands a huge higher respect in the gemstone industry. They're so cold. Oh, they're gorgeous. Because if they were faux sapphires, they would be warm. Um, they're amazing. They are just amazing. Let's put these up to my neckline. Now they graduate from a three by two up to a six by three. The 22 centimeters goes from bead to bead, not from tassel to tassel. Oh my word, they're beautiful. Have you had any of our sapphires, Janet? I haven't, no, but they are gorgeous. And the rondel shape is just beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. To have one of the world's most precious gemstones, a rondel of this. I love how highly polished they are as well. Beautiful. I think I'd make a sapphire ring. 
three three sapphires in a ring so three sapphires in a ring what would you use for the ring uh, i'll probably use sterling silver okay um and just put three across the top just a simple band around mm -hmm. um and price wise mm. what are you looking uh, personally depending on where you, you sell it that's it because when we talk about selling jewelry it really depends on the demographic you're able to sell to if you live in a very affluent area you're going to be able to sell a higher price but but i've got a regular outlet that that i use um and i'd be saying 30 30 plus 30 plus for 925 stone silver and three of those ring. so for three of the gemstones so how much would you expect the silver to cost you oh, do you think I depends it depends you probably use what not a meter so i don't know say, so, say you say six seven pounds even for the yeah. silver okay so you're looking at a ring Under over 10 pounds, pounds it's going to cost you to make it oh my word now these are usually incredibly low price incredibly low price remember the buying power of the company you're buying from and this is the last chance you've got to own this strand now also something that i was um sort of halfway through my thought process telling you earlier because of the way that we buy it's really irritating but positive at the same time because when we get a good supply in we put it out there straight away so recently you've seen when did you last see tans night on the show Didn't we have it on pretty much every day throughout the whole of January? Didn't we have pretty much throughout the whole of February Aquamarine? Haven't we seen of late a lot of sapphire? When did you last see big, chunky, beautiful faceted pieces or beautiful pieces of tanzanite on this channel? Because that's what we do. And because of the nature of the business, when we get a big package in, we'll get it and we'll get it out to you. And because we are able to do that, you get incredibly low prices. It does mean that in terms of the gemstones, you can't rely on us being able to provide you with these high ends at low prices all the time. So the positive thing is that you get the deals because of the way we buy uh, and source the gemstones. And in this instance, we've got this gemstone directly from the source and then taking it directly to our workshops in Jaipur in India. But the, the negative thing is, you won't be able to get these next week. Well, they'll have gone because of the low prices. But we can do the low prices because of the way that we buy and we buy in bulk. We could drip feed you throughout the year. We could have a huge amount of sapphires and we just keep one strand a week. We could do that. But what happens to our warehouse space? It would have to incre increase hugely 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 it's been looked into and if we do that your price is gonna have to go up because obviously the business has to pay for it some way so the way that we keep prices low is that we bulk buy we take them directly to our workshops in Jaipur in India or we bulk buy directly from an incredibly low supplier because of the amount that we're buying with the gemstones that come from Jaipur in India chances are we've been able to get an even better price on them because we've bulk bought so to make jewelry for gems TV and rocks TV as well and because we are keeping our warehouse space down to a minimum, we bring them directly to you. So you do get a lot of one gemstone for a couple of weeks perhaps, and then you don't see it sometimes ever again. So please do not take for granted the fact that Sapphire has been on your screen at a ready amount recently. Remember, we bought our supplies in way before it started to become depleted for Colour Sapphire. This is natural Colour Sapphire. And soon, you will not be seeing it on your screens anywhere near the frequency that you've been seeing this here. And that's been proven to you since the start of the year so far. Because all of that tantanite that we had, all of that aquamarine that we had, and we had it in loads. It's gone. Okay? We're going to be getting more tantanite and we're going to be getting more aquamarine in. I'd be very surprised if we get anywhere near the volume of sapphire in again that we've had because packets do circulate even though it might have all gone from the mines there will still be it will still be so sold on the gemstone market okay you ready over half stock's gone wait oh we've only really got 26 left good luck 34.95 for both of these times you will be absolutely potting to miss out on them gutted to miss out on it and in just and it remember are you right janet I'm, I'm a little bit shocked <laughs> i know oh, i want them those for nine five for both. If you can make a ring to sell for, you've made it for less than ten pounds, and you're selling it for over thirty because it's got three sapphires, three sapphires in it. 
and your silver will cost you about six pounds to use for your silver so literally oh my word there's a good profit word, there massive profit massive profit look at the amount of sapphires in there and also how gorgeous to be able to give a sapphire piece of jewellery as a gift that's the thing even if you're not selling just to be able to give someone a sapphire ring or a sapphire pendant or and do you know, know what I think beautiful. we don't talk about enough making jewellery for ourselves well yes yeah you sort of take that for granted you don't sort of think about that do no, you, you I think never made jewellery for myself mm. anymore oh I made a pendant the other day and I don't even like it I just like oh I need a pendant to go out it's about my birthday I need a pendant to go out um, I don't like it in the end I don't worry about it because I didn't take time because it was for me I was just like oh yeah that'll do uh, <laughs> but something like this I need a mouthful of banana can I have a bit of banana? Did you just ask if my banana's new? No, <laughs> it's already half eaten, Claire. Mm. <laughs> I thought you were asking if my banana was new. I was asking what's coming up. No, no, we're doing something new. Mm. We're going over to Janet when I'm ready, but I'm just eating a bit of banana. I don't mind. I don't mind if people see me eating bananas. See me eating bananas as well. Oh. Mm. Woo, me, caveman. I don't know why that's a game. It's like a chicken, isn't it? It's like a chicken. Yeah. Thank you, Amelia. If you'd like to duck into the show. I keep telling Charlie, don't talk with Malcolm. He's 16 months. He's very good, actually. He's saying please and thank you without being prompted now. It is peas and tantrum. Oh. Um, but we're there. Bless. I know! Sweet. I'm slightly obsessed. I don't know if I've mentioned the fact that I had a little baby boy who's now not a baby anymore. He's like a fully fledged teenager, he's 16 months old. Um, and uh, it's amazing. Um, okay, so to everybody else out there who is on the phone lines for those sapphires, few strands left, get them while you can. We're going to go over to our next kit. This isn't the kit, it's the Matrix box. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Mm. This was um, absolutely amazing when I opened it. And the story solution as well, which is just A story fabulous. solution, the gemstone. Got it all. You must have used hardly any. This is what I've got left. Oh my word. <laughs> this is what Janet made. Oh my word, it is beautiful. You need to see all of these in details. <gasps> Oh my word, I love that. Look at that two-tone metal. I love it. Oh, Janet, your jewelry is just fabulous. Look at, look, look at what Janet's got left. Not touched a garnet. Masses of labradorite. Hematite coming out your ears. Masses of findings. Masses of findings. More. Look at everything left. Oh my word, you probably got at least, you could do all that again. Easily. Eas and Easily more. do it again. Right, let's have a good look at what you've made. Oh, Janet. And literally all I've added to that is the beading thread. Um, and a, yeah, the beading thread. All you've added is beading thread. The rest of it is, is from here. All Janet has added is beading thread. Oh my word, look, look. Ah, oh, right, let's look in close detail because these were made that, ah, oh. ah, oh. ah, oh. right, okay. Wow, so first of all, ah. Oh. These are amazing. Look at it, you get everything that you can see. Every single ingredient other than beading thread. Well, chances are you've got 50 meters of it at home anyway. Look at these earrings. This is flying out. <gasps> this, oh my word, how on trend is that? Mix your tones, your metallic tones. How on trend is that? Everything, including the chain, the class, everything is included in the matrix box. Goodness me! Now, look, look at this. Look. If that isn't high-end boutique, I don't know what is. That is so stunning. Can we get even closer on that one, please, Mike? Because I don't know if you can see, but Janet's actually used the gold little balls in there as well. Isn't that? Oh. And that again is simply just a chain stitch. Again, as I said, you, you could do it on your finger like a daisy chain. Uh, three strands of that with the stones on and then plait it together. It's I need a really that. simple I need technique. That for my mum. Can I have that for my mum? She's going to a wedding at the weekend. 
I need, still need to sort out a sparkly belt. We're doing that this afternoon. Don't worry, we're on it. Uh, oh, can I just also say, I haven't even mentioned it, I feel awful. Uh, awful. Happy birthday, Dad. He's 502 today. <laughs> Everyone's saying happy birthday, Dad. Happy birthday. Um, he's actually, won't be, be able to see the repeat of it, he's actually um, volunteering at the Stroke Rehabilitation Unit all day today. Um, so um, when you do see it though, happy birthday, love you dad. Um, okay, so then these gorgeous cluster earrings, just after my brief interlude. <gasps> now then, we talk endlessly about mixing metals being really on trend, goodness me. They're amazing. Everything is from the Matrix box. Everything, everything, apart from the beading thread. Now look at this as well. A two-tone. That is, ah. Uh, a two, ah. Uh. How much are you salivating and palpitating over all this? It's flying out. It is absolutely flying out. So feel free to text in and praise Janet on this because it is just amazing. So everything that you see there, and yet, can I put this on the overhead camera, please? Can I put this on camera five? Because... Um, everything, oh, <laughs> nearly <laughs> dropping everything over the set. This is everything that's left. Everything, that's what's left. It just went on and on and on. And I, I did tell a little porky just, I added beading thread, but I also added a couple of um, head pins. Oh, okay. But apart from that, it, it's this, and there's all that left. So what, do you know what, we need to bring in the prize, don't we? You have got, Findings coming out of your ears. You've got genuine hematite. You've got a deluxe bead scoop um, tube, sorry. And within the deluxe bead tube, you're going to get the genuine garnet, labradorite, and smoky quartz. This is one of our most popular matrix boxes we've ever, ever, ever done. Oh, 800, 6 triple four, six triple five. How about if I, have to, if I was to say you get the genuine garnet, labradorite, and smoky quartz? Oh, do you know what? I'm showing that half done here. Let me show you the full complete piece, full pe complete collection. Now you're going to get the storage box as well. In the storage box, you can store your polymer clay in. And um, then you're going to get four individual storage boxes here as well. So you've got your gold colour findings, copper findings, then you've got your antique bronze copper findings. In this bead tube, outstanding Janet, you are so inspirational from Aileen in Lan uh, Lanarkshire. Thank you, Aileen. That means a lot. Thank you. And it, it is, ah, oh, it really is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful jewellery. Beautiful jewellery. Every single, I buy every single one of those pieces. That is an amazing box. And the tube, genuine smoky quartz, labradorite and garnet. They're all nuggets in there and they are all drilled, ready to go. It's a deluxe high-end tube. Now, for those of you who've had this before, it has been seen before, get it again. Now, I've got about a 20-second queue on the phone line. So don't, don't put the phone down. You're answering the order that you press your option one. And so far, everyone on the phone lines will definitely be successful. Quarter of the slot's gone, but we had a massive quantity, so it's okay. Um, right. Oh, I haven't even brought the price in. Good luck, everyone. It is just gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. We're going to learn technique in just a moment. It's only 34.95. And you get masses, absolutely masses. So not even half, not even half of that nature this gets it in perspective what's the average price of our kits here at jewelry maker average price 24.95 so really if you were to get two kits you'd be looking at an average about 50 pounds well you've got more than you would get in two kits here for 34.95 that gets it in perspective doesn't it and everybody's got beading thread in the stash yeah and little bits of findings and things left up but only the findings you get in here they just they just go on and on and on they're beautiful charms that you've got uh, hi janet your jewelry made with the matrix box is absolutely amazing love jane in plymouth thank you jane jane thank you for taking the time because i think our designers don't get enough credit i mean look at that the inspiration because they don't get any pictures they don't get any ideas they literally get the ingredients and told here you are go I had a bit Stunning. on the block this week as well. Really? I thought I'd sort of lost my... Uh, Do you think you'd lost your mojo? I did actually at first. I wasn't quite <laughs> sort of um, with it this week. So it's nice to know that you oh. like them. I think this is some of my favourite jewellery I've ever had on the show. That, the bracelet's my favourite. I love Those it. Those three different colours um, plaited together. 
I'm just going to put it on because I can. Would you do it up for me, please? I will. Thank you. And um, all I did is just added the three little beads. I've got glasses on, but I can't actually see what I'm doing. My hands are a bit sweaty. So Seriously, so. multi-buy on this matrix box. There you go. Huh. I don't know why I feel the need to suck in my cheekbones. <laughs> Isn't that? Ah. Oh. Has this been photographed yet? When it's photographed, can I have that one? Thanks. Perks of the job. Uh, lots of people want to buy it. Go for it. That's just stunning. So what technique are you going to show to us? I thought we'd show the uh, little pendant with the hearts and the stars. This is lovely. It's a lovely combination, nice sentiment hearts and stars as yeah. well, isn't it? And I thought I'll show you because then the, the, the technique transfers into the little earrings as well. Brilliant. Um, so just to reiterate as well, the only thing that isn't included in the matrix box are any head pins and the beading thread that have been used. Well, chances are you've got the deals and the head pins today and the beading thread. You can pick it up off the website, but or you can get it in a kit, or you've probably got some at home, to be quite honest. I mean, we get so That's much good. beading thread in the kits awesome. as well. I just want to put it all on. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. And it's and using the beading thread as well makes it nice and light and nice and comfortable. Oh, I didn't do the class but hang on. And I think for sort of um summer summer wear it's um mm. and because it's crochet, can I fiddle a little bit? Do you mind me sort yes. of touching that if you sort Touch of stretch away. stretch it a little bit, it will sort of stretch and into shape. Ah, okay. Hi, girls. I love being called girls. Thanks, Mandy. <laughs> Lovely jewelry. What a great idea to give the Matrix box as a kit. We do not have enough inspiration for all of your um, uh, lovely Matrix boxes. I know. It's a great idea. Kim, good girl. She went, thanks. <laughs> she can't take the credit. It was Becky upstairs. You should, she's just saying she should have taken credit. Um, oh. You can make it all! <laughs> right, we'll get on with the demo. Shush now, Lucy. <gasps> Just bit my tongue. Charlie bit oh. his tongue yesterday and it bled. Oh dear. He was playing with the car. He went, ah! Oh, hmm. And I just bawled my eyes out. Anyway, we'll crack on. Yes. Um, so to make that round sort of pendant shape, I just took a long, long section. Again, probably a metre. Because once I did the section, I then carried up uh, to, to create the necklace. So all I did is threaded on the stars and hearts in, in sort of just random, well, you know, in that pattern. Alternate. Alternate, that's the word. <laughs> and then to do that, all I did is threaded, um, threaded it on, try and get them all in the same direction if you can. And then simply wrap that back through the heart and pull it. But then what I'm trying to do is trying to get it so that the beading thread is at the back. So all of them have the beading thread line at the back. So there, there you go. Put it into there. Make sure it's sort of about the same sort of width away as the rest of them. And pull. So there, so you've got the heart on there. And then I did that um, alternate heart star all the way along. If I do one more with the heart, so you can, we'll keep in the same pattern. So again, it's just sliding that on, wrapping the beading thread back around and through. Who says? Don't want it to lean in and block everybody's view. There we go. Pull that. Get it into a position so that you've got the distance where you want it, and pull and make the beading thread go around the back, and pull that quite tight. There you go, and then you've got a line of of the stones on there. Then, if you flatten them down a little bit and then just turn this around, the beading thread then will sort of, if you press that into shape, then if you take a star, I finished off with a star because it, it looked quite pretty and it was easy for finishing off. Put the beading thread through one way, and then through the opposite direction, if I can see. There we go. And pull that so that you've got that in the middle where you want it. Flip it over. Take one of your end sections and put it back through the star. Now the beading thread will go through quite a few times. 
So if you just do that and pull that quite tight, that will hold. Let me pull it, give that a bit of a yank. There you go. That will hold that then in place. So you've got your essential, the pendant shape. There we go. And then what I did for, for the earrings. Sorry to interrupt Sorry. you, Janet. Just to let you know, if you've just tuned in, Janet is um, recreating a piece that she's made from the Matrix box. We've got a few left in stock at 34.95. It is amazing, and I'm having a bracelet. Thank you. And then with these long pieces of beading thread, if you just wrap them around, it just sort of gives it that little bit more strength. Mm -hmm. So just literally, I'm okay. Wrap that around. I was thinking it looked very strong for beading thread. There you go, and then back through. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I probably haven't got quite. I haven't got a long enough section here. If I was doing it, I'd, I'd have um, enough so that I could go all the way round mm -hmm. and and sort of make the necklace from it. Sorry, concentrating halfway through a sentence. Stop. Welcome to my world. <laughs> there we go. So I would spend some time doing that. So do that neatly so that it, it sort of wraps around and you, you've not got any sort of overlapping overlapping your stones. There we go. I'll just do that quickly so we can get that finished. There we go. There. And then we're back to the top. And I would go around in the opposite direction then. And then you need to sort of straighten that out and it will if you if you spend time sort of and you see how it's bending you can actually bend that then into shape now you've got that second is that line. the type of thing that would benefit from being left overnight with a heavy book on it yes yes possibly do that uh, it's overlapped here so i would spend time actually wrapping that maybe a couple of times through each one okay so you haven't got any be beading thread going across mm -hmm. um, and then i would do exactly the same with the other side and go all the way round and then you've got your two pieces of beading thread here. Now for the earrings, what you can simply do is just, ha just thread that through a heart. There we go. Through a heart there. Pull that into shape. See, that's off to one side now because I haven't gone round all the way round. If I'd gone all the way round, we'd have had two okay. beading threads coming off. Sure, and, okay. And you've got that section there. But then with the pendant, what I did is I hooked that into place and then just dangled some. And you can see that just here. So attaching a jump ring. There we go. Fab. And all I did is when they, they overlap, when you go round both one way and then you go round the other way, they cross over. The, the wires will cross over. So you've got one one side and one the other. And then simply just put the jump ring through slip on um, the round part of the smallest toggle clasp that you've got the smaller toggle clasp and close that and this will probably be just off center because if we haven't done it mm -hmm. see it's off center but, but you certainly get the idea yeah so then so that would be in the middle sorry i've put it in the wrong place altogether that's all right life tally yes let me have a look let me, let me take that off again and i'll show you and then all I did was just simply use the head pins. I'm not fingers and thumbs today. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's called life. Do you think that's what it is? Yeah. Gets to us all, I suppose. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so there we go. That's the back. It's just most section. people don't have to do life on telly. No, 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 no. There. All right. So that's that section, and you would just, as I say, we're off centre because I haven't gone around yeah. the other way. And then all I did then was simply get the hearts, stars. And cut them to different lengths um, so you've got them um, sort of dangling down at, at whatever length you want and then just cut off the length that you want take the round nose pliers do a little loop on the end and then open that I might need to make that a little bit bigger just so it goes around the toggle clasp there you go open that Drop it onto the toggle clasp, close that, and then do that a few times, sort of at, at sort of different lengths, um, and then that sits sits in that section there. She says, so that'll sit there with different lengths of of the stars and the hearts on there. Lovely. And then with the be beading thread that you've got left here, if you've left enough on there, you can just continue around the neck. And if this isn't, you you don't just want one single strand. 
you could actually wrap another few pieces through the heart mm -hmm. so you've got a double or, th or triple and then you can plat it gorgeous so that's um thank that's you essentially so it. much apparently we've had some more text messages in so we'll have a look at this uh first one is from anonymous um Hi Janet and Lucy, just wanted to say what a wonderful jewellery designer you are. Lucy, that necklace really suits you. Thank you very much, I'll put it back on there. Thank you. I think it's quite fabulous, so I might have to have that as well. <laughs> that will. Uh, hi Janet, your design looks wonderful and your demos are so easy to understand. Great show ladies from Mercedes in Cambridge. So thank you very thank much you. indeed. And fantastic demo and beautiful pieces, Janet. Love it. From Debbie in Wiltshire. Thank you, Debbie. You see, you think you're all fingers and thumbs today, mm -hmm. but everyone's loving you. Uh, hi, Lucy and Janet. Wonderful show as always. Just wanted to say, Janet, what a wonderful designer you are. And Lucy, that necklace, beautiful. I know. I can't take one even millimetre credit for it at all. I am so inspired. This is from Esther and Vale of Glamorgan. I am so inspired. Wish my matrix was sitting in front of me. Yeah. Lush, lush. Lush. Thank you, ladies, for such a fun Monday morning. You're welcome. Yay! We've had so, fun. Well, yeah, we've still got an hour. We've got over an hour to go with the emeralds and the wee. There you go. It's all beautiful and classy, and I'm talking about emeralds, and I've just destroyed the whole classiness of classiness. <laughs> so, um, right, we'll come back to you shortly for the challenge. I've got this bracelet on. Right, we're going to cry, so praise you like a good. Do you remember that song? Praise you like a. Cry, so praise you like a. Oh, Christ praise. Bad joke. I'm such a mum, aren't I? That was more of a dad joke. That's even worse. Well, it is my dad's birthday today. Ah, oh, daddy. Can I tell you, know, I've told you what my dad's birthday present is from me. Tickets to Lionel, no, I keep saying Lionel G. Uh, tickets, to, I did Lionel Richard last year. Uh, tickets to Kenny G. That is an amazing birthday present. He actually really wants to go. We refused to go to Lionel Richie when I bought tickets last year. Yeah, right. <gasps> okay. We're now gonna do a gemstone strand that I love because it is completely different to every single gem that we've had on the show today. Really very, very different to the majority of other gemstones out there. And this for me is all about the color the shape, the size, and the cut. It is mega. They're big pieces. They're gonna lend themselves absolutely their screaming pendants. Screaming, screaming, screaming pendants. And on one strand, five. Five different proportions. Actually, potential for earrings and pendants as well. Look. Excuse me, darling. Mm. isn't that absolutely incredible there is a mystical magical right okay do you know what do you ever do you ever look at something and you get transported to being in a different place it takes you back these absolutely take me back to being in the V&A have you been to the V&A have you been to see the jewellery Janet have you been to see the jewellery in the V&A you need to go you have to go you can go into the jewellery area on the normal ticket Oh my word. Uh, it will, you're literally just standing there going. Amazing. So. A hundred and twenty carats of the bicolour. So let me show you the bicolour working in the gemstone here. Now they, in terms of the size, they go from a 20 by 13 up to a 36 by 15. That's minimum guaranteed. Is, oh. Look at that. B U R U nine two. Kim's just sorting out the price. It is completely, totally, and utterly natural. This is African bicolor chrysoprase, 
an outstanding gemstone we very rarely see. Exquisite. Do you know what? Let's just do it. It is stunning. Mm. This is so incredibly rare, so incredibly collectible. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Big, 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 big pieces. You can go for glamour, you can go for statement, you can go for single pendant. You could, do you know what? I talk about single pendants a lot. All in one necklace, all in one necklace. Maybe with some delicate little black spinel in between. Oh, what are you thinking, Janet? I think I would wire wrap the centre one oh. as a pendant and then make earrings so you've got a complete set. Um, what would you or do? You could for... use pendants. Sorry. No, oh, sorry, no, I'm just like, blah, 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 blah. Um, so if you wire wrap the centre one yeah. and you make a pendant, would you then just put it on chain or would you do anything beaded with it? Um, I think I'd put it on chain, to be honest. Mm. I think I'd use gold wire. Um, and wrap it. Uh, you don't want to cover too much of the stone, but just surround it, sort of frame it with with some gold wire, and then put it on a simple chain. Mm. I think that'd be great. That would be really stunning. And you're thinking silver, gold, gold. Rose I gold. think. I think I'd go for gold. Yeah, the gold yeah. maybe. Gold. Any of them really. Going for <laughs> gold. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> don't know why I had to put the arm partridge essence in there. And um, how are we doing on stock levels there, Kim? Free phone number 0800 644 There's lots of you there on the phone lines. I just adore the fact that it is so completely, totally and utterly different than anything else. Remember, you've got your first day money back guarantee, so I do appreciate it's different, that you want to experience it for yourself. I just adore that vibrant green. How many of you fans of Wicked the musical? <laughs> Claire's just gone, yeah, that's my favourite. There's something about it that you'd want them to sell this type of jewellery in the foyer of the theatre. Do you know what I mean? Because the witch is green. It's like a stained glass window. Like a stained glass window, like says kind of Mike. Look. It has got that reflective feel to it, uh, yeah. Yeah. Because you can see the like blue kind of stuff. Because you can see blues coming off different and colours. stuff yeah. and different yeah. colours. Mike, you should be mic'd up still. <laughs> Maybe we need Mike permanently on a mic. He's shaking his head. And Claire's just gone, probably not a good idea. No. <laughs> 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 Lots and lots of you there. If you're umming and ahhing about it, remember, you've got that 30-day money-back guarantee. It's completely, totally and utterly natural. Buy Colour Chrysoprase from Africa, 120 carats. Absolutely stunning. Five exquisite pieces going from a 20 by 13 up to a 36 by 50. Talking about stunning. Oh, I need those. Should we go to the Wall of Fame? Let's go to the Wall of Fame. I'm all about the bracelet, and this is all about the bracelet. Do you like the link? This is from Lynn Edwards in Cinderford. This is fabulous. been busy. Uh, here's my entry for this Wall of Fame. It's a selection of bracelets ready for my first Easter fair next weekend. All the best of luck, hun. Please, please put a good luck charm on this. I would certainly love to um, do with a win and a good fair. Either would be very nice. Good luck to everyone from Lynn Edwards in Cinderford. Lynn, best of luck, hun. I love the fact that you've got... on. You've got something for everybody in terms of colour and design there. You've done, um, you've worked with um, cords, you've got Viking knit in there, you're doing beading work. There's something for everybody. I really, really wish you all the luck in the world. You are four, three, nine. Let us know how it goes. This is very pretty. Really pretty. Isn't it lovely? Really pretty. This is 440 and this is sent in from Jessica Beckett from Birmingham. And she says, hi, my name is Jessica and I'm putting this in for my mum, Amanda Beckett. Uh, as she is ironing while watching Jewelry Maker. <laughs> and after one, when it ends, she is, um, she's going to teach me how to do the Kumahimo disc. Oh, fab! This is her earrings, ring and necklace that she has made. And I love, um, I love them. She has made loads of different rings that are just amazing. I would love it if you could show them. So this is Amanda Beckett's design sent in by Jessica. Jessica, good Beautiful. on you, hun. And uh, Amanda, you're still doing the ironing. Don't come around and do mine. Might need an ironing person soon. Literally, I've got that much washing 
It's just, I just get it out of the tumble dryer and then it's gone in the lounge and I don't go in the lounge. I don't iron. I hate it. Because it's just there. If I had time, I actually quite enjoy not ironing. I haven't got time. That's what mums are for. <laughs> get on with it, mother. <laughs> They're cracking on. <laughs> I am joking. And I do really, really appreciate her. And I got lots of treats for her to say thank you. Okay, here, moving on. Uh, this is from Jacintha in Northern Ireland and it says hi all here's my entry for this week's world of famous it's really classy I've been making jewelry for about nine months and at this stage I really enjoy it and I'm loving getting all of my lovely purchases from jewelry maker I've attached a picture of one of my creations made from all the items from JM pearls smoky quartz and links and catches made from 0.8 gold wire from JM and I hope it's good enough love the show and the great deals from Jacintha in Northern Ireland Jacintha that is fabulous you've only been making nine months and it is truly professional and gorgeous and just stunning 441 good luck this is 442. Isn't that oh, beautiful? Wow, how she got those to stay on? But this is jewel enamel. Gorgeous. No way. And it's from Sue Con. Um, I don't know where you are, Sue, but Sue says, Hi all at JM. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. Purple jewel enamel and bead caps. Hope you like it. Uh, loving all the new offers and demos, but please, please, more ideals for jewel enamel as the brain cells are is dying. Kind regards. Oh, Sue from Surrey. There you go. Yeah, jewel enamel with the bead cap sort of so pressing. Fab. Isn't that beautiful? Now, jewel enamel ideas, I can't say much, but just wait for the birthday. Um, good luck. <laughs> 443. This is from Cheryl in Grimsby. Hi, JM. This week's all the famous are two uh, cavishons and two precious gems, uh, pebbles from my hoard. Oh, fab. Uh, all wrapped with JM copper wire and these are the first wire wrapping caging uh, beads I've tried and even though they're no Laura binding I'm pleased with them oh bless you they're gorgeous the pebbles took a little more work than I expected as the first one flew out of the cage and across the room as I was tightening it so I need more practice fingers crossed for a win so I can buy more cabochons to play uh, and practice on lots of love to all from Cheryl in Grimsby Cheryl they're fab 443 they're really fab good luck to you right we need a little bit of a break to get prepared for something quite major. We've only got limited stock. They're completely natural. They're gonna sell out. Oh my word. Please quickly try and do a price comparison. We are gonna do what Jewelry Maker does best and wow you on natural Brazilian emeralds. We don't believe this price can be beaten anywhere near you can't get it anywhere near. It's just going to be amazing. Don't go anywhere. Please get them on the other side of this. A big hello from everyone here in Jaipur. Namaste. Did you know that every individual gemstone in our Gems of Distinction collection goes through a seven-stage intricate process to get from the rough to a beautiful bead? In a pile of emerald like this, you really have a wealth of different qualities here. Everything from the kind of quality of gemstones that we've refaceted into gems ready for jewellery, right through to your cabochons, through to your really, really high quality beads, through to the strands which you might have seen on jewellery maker before. And then some flat faceted pieces as well. Before any of the gemstones that arrive here in Jaipur can leave Jaipur for the UK, they need to be tested. So all the genuine gemstone strands go from the vendor to an independent laboratory. They're then tested to prove that they are what they say they are. Now as you can see here, this shipment of emerald arrived this morning and it comes with this. This is really important. This shows that the emerald has been tested in random strands and can be proven to be genuine emerald. If this authenticity card doesn't arrive with the genuine gemstone, then the shipment won't go to the UK.
Look at these. Look at these. Oh, am I excited or what? If there are any left, my best friend is getting a piece of jewellery from me for her birthday this year made out of these because they're her birthstone. These are May's birthstone. Text in, text in, text in, text in, text in. What do you make of these? The colour, the cut, the clarity, the carrot weight. Oh! GWG Z47. Now, what you're looking at here is one of the world's most in-demand gemstones. And where you're looking, look, 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 look. The big wow factor to take into consideration is the source. There are three primary sources for high quality emeralds. Colombian, Zambian, and Brazilian. Now, the beauty of Brazilian is your really amazing depth of color combined with fab clarity. These are so in demand. Did you see the program about boodles the other day? Did you see it? And they were making a necklace. Now, I am not saying that these are, they're nowhere near the size of emeralds, so they were using to sell over a, over a, uh, sorry, over a million pounds. But they've chosen to make a flagship piece of jewellery using emeralds because emeralds are absolutely recognisable, aspirational, inspirational, rare, and beautiful. Now, how many of you have ever made a piece of emerald jewellery before? Genuine emerald jewellery. Remember, here at Jewellery Maker, you are sourcing gemstones directly from one of the largest sources in the world. These emeralds have done the shortest journey physically possible to get to you. They have gone from the mine to Jaipur, our workshops in Jaipur in India, where everything that needed to be done has been done. Cutting, polishing, drilling, threading on a plane, on a boat. These are actually came up by boat which is another reason why your price is really low. <laughs> the way that we ship them. A quarter of the stock's already gone. They're a one by one up to a three by two. Now that 18 centimeters goes from bead to bead. That does not include the tassel. Look at the quantity going down, oh my word. Right, I'm gonna hold them up to my neckline. They are some of the best emeralds I've ever had on the channel. Categorically, 100%, because they're natural, they're Brazilian. Look at them, I mean, look at them, look at the color. Look, 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 look. Now, if you want to buy emeralds, if you're thinking of make, making emerald jewelry, buy these and buy them now. The reason that they look a little bit kinky there, ooh, um, is because they're on a temporary strand. They just need to go on some official beading thread. And for 18 centimeters, hello, they are jam packed on there. Janet, with your fabulous world of design imagination, what would you do with this strand? If I got that, I think, as we were talking about making jewellery for ourselves, I'd make myself just a simple emerald bracelet. Would you? With a silver clasp on it, and just wear it and look at it all day. Knowing that you own an emerald bracelet that you've made yourself out of one of the most precious gemstones on the planet, fact. Absolute fact. Now, the reason that you're getting these for such a low price is because the amount that was initially bought from, <coughs> excuse me, from the work from the uh, mines in Brazil was actually huge, much bigger than the amount that we've got available here because the rest of the emeralds have probably gone over to Gems TV or Rocks TV to be put into jewellery. Because this has all been done in our very own workshops, the Genuine Gemstone Company has its own jewellery workshops with our own lapidarists, our gemstone cutters, uh, who do all the work on the gemstones. Um, from drilling to any treatment that would be required uh, for threading, they do it all in our workshops in Jaipur in India, where Rocks TV and Gems TV, a lot of the jewellery is made right. Code on the top of your screen means discount. Discount, discount, discount. You're going to get these at an amazing price. Bulk buy if you are in the market to do so, as some people are. Now, with that length, an 18 centimetre strand, if you want a full necklace, obviously go for two. One brilliant way to space them out. Have we got any of the early bird left? I think that's all gone. But obviously the little spacers. Excuse me a second while I just have a drink of water. Oh, sorry about that. 
0800 655 5. If you are genuinely interested and you're thinking, if they're as long as they go to the good price of having them, start dialing now. Had a message in. Really can't resist emeralds. Into basket and checked out as quickly as possible. Dawn. Dawn. Thank you very much for texting in. Dawn. When have you seen a strand like this before? Dawn. Why don't you get two? Do we make a prize this? Oh, I was going to say half the price of elsewhere. I can't do direct price comparisons and possibly even less than that. They're going to be so good. Right, loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of you there. Um, I'm just trying to see. Now then, I've got lots of people with it in their baskets. Please check out your basket immediately. We've got loads of people sat with this in their baskets. Right, so let's get perspective. 15 carats of one of the world's most in-demand gemstones ever in the history of mankind. Alongside diamonds and sapphires and rubies. You are buying from one of the largest sources of genuine gemstones in the world. You have a 30-day money-back guarantee. The other great thing is you can pop onto our website or speak to the call centre and we can send you a certificate of authenticity. Look at that glow. Look at that glow. Look at the clarity. I think the best way to get um, the best out of these emeralds is these have been packed on the strand so you get as many as physically possible can fit on. It's not doing the emeralds justice. They need to have light being able to bounce to them. So maybe if you've got those dinky little spaces in the finest pack that we did earlier, space them out. Even putting crimp beads in between them. Even pearl knotting in between. Just allow the emerald not to touch the emerald necessarily would be my advice. What about a rosary chain with emerald, with a 95 stunning silver wire? What about using rose gold with it? Completely different look again. If you've got that findings pack that we did at trade price earlier, how about using those 2.4 meters worth of head pins and creating your own rosary chain with emeralds? 15 carats of one of the world's most in-demand gemstones going to a jewel remaker price. Can you actually resist? Can you? Can you actually resist? How many of you sell your jewelry? How many of these would you use in a design? Would you use sh do chandelier earrings? Would you get a 95 cylinder silver head pin and do Gemma Crow's designs and making stud earrings, emerald stud earrings? How much do you think you could pay, sell a pair of emerald stud earrings for? What do you think, Janet? Oh gosh. Um, sterling silver, emerald, I, I, 20, 25 I was going to say about 20. About 20 well, pounds. how many for a pair of stud earrings? Funnily enough, two. Um, I wouldn't say you, the, the dinkiest ones would be appropriate for um, stud earrings, but certainly the big cluster in the centre. Yeah? A few of those in a little bracelet. They are out of this world. They're already going, they're going, they're going, they're going, they're going, they're going, they're going. We started at 100. <laughs> Now, as I always say with shuns like this, that is not indicative of worth or value. If you are getting this quality at that price, get the jewellery that you make valued and let us know about it. Free phone number 0800 644 5 Masses of you there. We sat with this in your baskets. We need you to press that buy now button and check out immediately. Maze Burstone, elsewhere, have you seen what other jewellers are doing with the prices of emeralds? Have you seen what happens to the price of diamonds just before April? Have you seen what happens to the price of Factor Marine just before March? Have you seen what happens to the price of amethyst just before February? Have you seen what happens to the price of, Janu uh, of Janet? <laughs> Janet is not for sale. <laughs> Garnet, just before January. You can see how I came to the Janet with I, Garnet yeah. in January. Yeah. Is your birthday January? June. <laughs> <laughs> That would be good, wouldn't it? It would have been, you know, it'd have helped me out with, yeah, yeah. Claire's saying all the best people are born in June. Claire, are you going away on your birthday? You're not anymore. What do you mean it's been changed? What are you doing? You're doing a different trip. Claire's going trekking around America. 0800 655 she's going in July, just so you can all keep up to date with Claire's life story. 47.95 for that caliber of emeralds. Now, how many do we start with? 100? Okay, they're still going. We have got tons of you with this satin in your basket. And I can understand why. It's probably the only thinking, do I check out? Do I buy them? Don't I? Do I? Don't I? Yeah, you do. You live once. Yeah, you do. Just buy them. Now, the quantity that you see on your screen 
If everybody checks out, we haven't got anywhere near that quantity left. So we're going to leave that with you. Check out your baskets. We started with 100. Good luck, good luck, good luck. I actually did properly kiss them. Promised myself I wouldn't buy anything today, but ah, oh, the colours of those emeralds brought them as quick as I could. Uh, a slightly poorer Ophelia. Ophelia, I love that name so much. It's beautiful, beautiful. And beautiful emeralds for a beautiful named lady. Gorgeous. It'd be rude not to. And you live once. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, where should we go to next? Can I just say, I think we've still got some of the aquamarine strand left. It's six ninety five aquamarine, aquamarina, aquamarine, six ninety five. Right, six ninety five. I just wanted to recap this because I was really annoyed. I wasn't really annoyed. How can you be annoyed at all? But I was really jealous. Like, how come Mike gets to present that strand? It's amazing. Genuine aquamarine. Again, massively in demand in the same family as emeralds. Same family as emeralds, aquamarine, really subtle, delicate blues, perfect for bridal jewellery. If you just want a subtle little something blue in there, pop in a little aquamarine. Because if you do bridal jewellery, that could last you potentially the whole of your career as your little nod to something blue in the jewellery that you make, because there's masses of them. £6.95, 130 carats, the code is EGGK11. 130 carats, and they are nuggets going from a 4x1 up to an 8x3. Right. So. Can I tell you my little problem? <laughs> that could have sound really personal, wouldn't it? Let me tell you my little problem I've got here. I think that because our prices are so low, I wonder if we sometimes undervalue gemstones. And I wonder if sometimes you think, I wonder if it's easy to get complacent. And the reason I'm saying is that is because I get complacent about the prices. But I've just been absolutely shocked because we've got genuine fire opal here. Now, I used to present fire opal jewelry over on Gems TV. I used to work for an incredibly known jewellers many moons ago and fire opal jewellery was present there and to look at this strand there's not a chance if I was that okay so tell me ask me how much I thought this strand would be jewellery maker prices thank you Claire for asking me the question I shall answer your question I thought that would be 39.95 what would you say, Janet? I'd have said around that, but probably even a little bit more, to be honest. Genuine fire opal. Now it's Mexican. Mexican fire opal is the most in-demand fire opal in the world. You are so lucky to be getting this right now. Oh my goodness, I said that like my mother. Right, 50 carats of it. Seriously, I know. So to everybody who thought, oh, I'll just tune in today and I'll see what's what. Oh my word, you have to buy this strand. I actually think as well that this strand would look amazing with the second kit. Yes, yes would it would. It? That'd be fabulous. With those gorgeous sort of the sunrise, sunset kit that was actually just called sunrise. <laughs> the sunrise kit that Janet prepared for us. Now, opal, 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 opal. Instantly, I know I've probably said this before, but if you have issues with grey hairs, apparently if you wear opal in your hair, it stops you getting as many greys. I cannot guarantee that to be the case, but hey, it's worth a go. It's really popular apparently in Russia to wear it on a hairband. That's why you'll see a lot of ladies wearing opal hairbands. Apparently it walks off grey hairs. I cannot guarantee that to be the case. And actually, this is going to be less than the price it cost me to get my hair dyed. And it'll last me forever. There you go. See, I'm saving you money by spending money. I'm saving you money. So within this strand, you've got such a beautiful variety of different shades. So they go from a six up to a nine millimeter. Now the 18 centimeters um, goes from gemstone to gemstone. Again, this isn't from end of tassel to end of tassel. They are so exquisite. Can I check the treatment, please? Yeah, totally natural. No treatment whatsoever. So Mother Nature has provided 
exactly these for you. Exactly these. Thank you, Mother Nature. Now, check out the clarity on some of them as well. So, how much are you expecting? I honestly was expecting about thirty nine ninety five. Yeah, yeah. Claire's just said, look at that one. It almost looks like it's been dip dyed. It hasn't. That is natural. Isn't that cool? It's funny because we're all picking out our favourite ones. And even the amazing white opal there. Stunning. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful droplets. I think these are gorgeous for summer jewellery. You just can't go wrong with them, can you really? I think with clusters little clusters of these what sort of designs are you thinking janet i think sort of um because of the the drop shape like a cascade necklace or cascade earrings i think they look really nice mm. um maybe with some um maybe a silver shape sort of a, a round sort of donut shape with some things hanging with those hanging from it mm. um, you could do so much with them they make great earrings as well because of the shape of them mm. dangling Fabulous. them off chain just yeah Maybe three of them from different lengths different of chain. Lengths. Oh, yeah, classy, classy. You are so going to get your money's worth out of these. And Opal, of course, hugely, hugely, hugely in demand. Fifty carrots. Are you ready for this? It's ridiculous. Uh, <clears throat> Oh no! Shop, 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 shop. Seventeen ninety five again. Just to reiterate, this is not implying worth or value. It's seventeen ninety five. Do you think this strand should be at this price? It is absolutely bonkers. Fabulous thickness of fabulousness. At seventeen ninety five, it's absolutely crazy. Talking about crazy, here she is. Little tennis balls inserted into her legs. Jenny Cleary. <laughs> So, yeah. Do you look like you work in a very well known supermarket beginning with tea? Do you look like you work in a very well known supermarket beginning with tea? Yes! It's a uniform, I'm wearing it today. She thinks she's wearing a supermarket uniform. Right. Oh, she does. She carries it off brilliantly. £17.95 for amazing fire opal. Mexican fire opal. Just look at that. Z I R U, thank you. <laughs> I, mean, yeah. I mean, it's just wafted a microphone in my face because this is where I get to feel like I'm a proper telepresenter. Because I've got a microphone. I feel like I'm proper. I feel like Davida McCall, eat your heart out. Other TV presenters are available. Right. Hello, ladies. Now, let you know what's going on today. Laura Binding, citizen of Laura Binding, has a workshop taking place. Did you know that we have a huge variety of workshops covering a massive amount of different mediums here at Jewelry Maker? Now, we have some familiar faces here as well. So, Laura, hello. Hi. You haven't got a mic. No. I'm going to scoot over the other side first. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Where do you come from and what are you doing? My name is Laura. Yeah. I'm from Bristol. Yeah. Are um, you Gertlush? I am Gertlush, my lover. Lovely. <laughs> and we're doing so, cuff and bangles. Cuffs and bangles. So if you've not met Laura before, Laura is one of the most outstanding wire work designers you will ever come across. And if you can get on one of her workshops, do. And if you can catch her on the shows, do, because she's very in demand. Um, <laughs> so on the workshop today, cuffs and bangles. Yeah. And you're already well and truly making a weight. Now, I've only got three of you. There are four of you. Yeah, there's one hiding. Oh, look at Lady Bolford in there as well. Oh, uh, and <laughs> Debbie Bolford's in The food's in there. The food's in there. She's after the buffet. So, hello. Would hello. you like to say your name and where you're from? Norma. I'm from Portsmouth. Norma. Is this um, your first time you've ever done a wire work bangle? Yes. So any wire work, <laughs> any wire work, any wire work. This is the first time that you have ever done any wire work. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, we'll do. We'll expose it on live TV. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> like, wow! 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 Now this isn't your first workshop, is it? No. It's the tenth. Familiar. <laughs> it's the tenth. But your first wire work. Mm -hmm. Goodness. Yep. So wow, that is amazing. You've seriously never done wire work before. No. That's crazy, Laura. You're obviously a very good teacher. <laughs> <laughs> wow, amazing. 
beautiful Thank beautiful you. and then if i move along yeah. here i've been pointing to you through the window going yeah i love your hair so you've got fabulous hair so what's your name Thank where you're you. from i'm lorraine i'm from older shop lovely oh, to be very first jm workshop and are you enjoying um, it? Yeah, yeah. You'll be you'll be basically setting up camp yeah. here now. It's <laughs> ace. So the piece that you've made, have you done much? Well, obviously you do wire work because I've just started sort of. Did you make this necklace? Yes. You've just started. Oh, how yeah. ridiculous! She's fabulous. <laughs> and uh, let's have a look at this one here. They're gorgeous. This is a really lovely design. Yeah. Mm. Really lovely design. I'm loving the uh, the finishing off of it. You've already yeah. done a bangle, yeah. so this is the second no, design the second here. Design, yeah. Ah! Thank and you. move up, I've just put me along here. Mm -hmm. And actually, you met this lady yesterday, yes. but we'll <laughs> pop her on tell again. Tell everybody your name and where you're from. Hi, I'm Bev. I'm from York, just outside York Court. Now, have you called in at home? How are the Shetland ponies? The ponies are fine. They've been and, this morning, yeah. Oh, good, good. She's got Shetland ponies there. So that's why you mm -hmm. need to touch and she's got Shetland ponies. But also, happy anniversary again for yesterday. Did you have a nice meal with your husband? Fabulous, yeah. yeah 18 did, yeah. years married, yeah. Day. See, I remembered all the details. We and were blind dates, so we did quite well. You were blind yeah. dates? Oh, how fabulous! <laughs> what, like, still a black blind date? No, no, friends <laughs> put, us, friends put <laughs> us up together because we've both been in a previous marriage and been unhappy and had it ending, you know, bad ways. And we got put together as a blind date and we've been together 20 and married 18. So yeah. I love it. Who needs Scylla when you got your mate? You don't, Max. <laughs> ah, ace. And you've got yours on here. Yeah. And let's make... Did that on, on Saturday at the ring, uh, the first so one. So that was Laura's other workshop Shop, on, on yeah, Saturday. On and because you basically off, set up camp yes, here. Have, love yeah. it, love it, love it. So we've got loads of workshops that you can take place, um, come to the studios and be a part of here and um, lots of different mediums so give us a call speak to the call center and ha or have a look on our website or have a look up in the latest jm hub magazine you'll see the workshop lists and get on but i have to warn you laura's get booked up really really quickly and um, we've got less people today yeah it's a bit of a yeah. quieter day a bit today. of a quiet today monday today. Monday, monday monday it's hard work <laughs> hard i'm a lady of luxury so you're a lady of luxury not it's even of leisure darling she's yeah. luxury <laughs> well <laughs> Yes. And it's your birthday today! I was right, come on team. <laughs> Cleary, <laughs> Cleary, on screen. Amelia, and your name oh, again, please, darling. Lorraine. Don't Lorraine, happy, happy birthday to Lorraine, ready? Happy birthday! And Thank you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Stop! Not allowed to sing anymore because of royalties, <laughs> but it's Lorraine's birthday. Round of applause, please, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Give her the bumps. Thank you, sir. <laughs> you can give her the bumps later. That's Jenny Cleary. Jenny Cleary is currently. I think to go. I'm wearing a supermarket outfit beginning with T. Do you? Do you think I look like I'm from that supermarket with this uniform on? Do you? I do. No comment. Let's carry on with the show. We'll see you girls <laughs> later. Yes. Awesome legs. Yeah, it's like little tennis balls inserted into her legs. She makes me sick. Go and eat a pie, Cleary. Go and eat a pie. Right, eat some. What of them pies? Uh, Jenny Cleary, just so you know, is it confirmed that you are on the morning show on Friday? You got her on the morning show on Friday. Are you are you not here on Friday? No. Kim's <laughs> I won't tell you what Kim's up to. Jenny probably will later. Right. Um, so we're just gonna do um the Rainbow Road kit. So this is the kit that we had a preview of earlier to challenge Janet. <gasps> this is going to be better than half price. If you were to buy everything individually off the website tomorrow morning, nine o'clock tomorrow morning, it would cost you 51 51 pounds and 10 pence. So let's have a look what you're getting. And of course we gave Janet all of this to, uh, to have a good old play with today, of which she's had about, oh, five seconds to do something. Um, so it's amazing that you've done anything at all. So these are three strands of genuine gemstones and they're pyrite, but they're rainbow coated. So how's this work? Well, basically there has been an incredibly fine metallic coating. So it's a metal coating that goes and adheres to the top layer of the gemstone. So you can still see 
the presence of the pyrite and the natural colour of the pyrite, but then you've got this fabulous coating on the top. So the ovals, I'll just get the sizes for you. Ovals are 16 by 12. The twisted drums are 12 by 8. And the hexagons are 10 by 8. Okay, three strands of genuine gemstones. 38 centimetres guaranteed minimum on each strand. Massive, massive carat weight. 310 carats, that'll be 570... Where's my other carrot weight gone? Where have you gone? Where have you gone? Oh, wow. Uh, 1,150. 1,150 carrots are genuine gemstones. Big old carrot weight there. Massive, massive, massive. Now, don't you think that this would be amazing if you got the Matrix box earlier because you got all the dinky little stars and hearts in there of the rainbow pyrite, didn't you? Now... You're also going to be getting all of your threading materials. 50 metres of beading thread, 6 metres clear elastic and 18 metres of monofilament. The organza ribbon, you're going to get 20 metres. So one of the packs, um, it would be 10 metres, you're going to get that same colour array twice. Which is really fab, so you get two lots of the apple green, daffodil, dress blue, emerald, hot pink, plum, red, regal purple, tangerine and turquoise. 20 metres of each. Look at that. Look at that colour. Ooh. Okay. On top of all of that, and bearing in mind the price tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock will be £51.10, you get a findings pack. Now this finding pack is absolutely gorgeous. It's the basic in terms of, well it's not basic at all, but it's, there's nothing sort of um, particularly focused about it. They're very simple, elegant findings. Simple and elegant. Talking about simple and elegant, here she is, the Bulfords arriving for the Design and Inspiration show alongside Den Jenny Cleary, you're in for a fabulous afternoon. So you've got a metre of chain, 45 head pins, your extender chains, lobster um, with the uh, S-class barn, the ribbon cord ends, you've got three pairs of shepherd hooks, you've got your connector, you've got twisted loops in there, twisted um, sh uh, jump rings, oh, actually forgot the word I was after then, I uh, got it, uh, crimp bee, crimp bees covers, saw cut jump rings, all of it. Now, once again, the whole contents of this kit is actually our highest price of the whole day, usual price, at £51.10. Guess what? Biggest saving of the day, proportionately, more than 50%. 24 pounds 95 24 The code is QTGC47. Free phone number 0800-644-655. Amazing value for money, and you can use your Visa and your MasterCard Confirm, confirm, confirm. They're amazing. They're absolutely amazing. And the Matrix boxes have absolutely flown out uh, today, that Matrix box. I've got a couple of others to show you. I've got a couple of others. So that is amazing. Close, wasn't it, Mike? Yeah. You had my back, you went. That really helped. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, Mike's moment. I'm really liking the idea that if Mike has his own soundtrack for when he presents on the show, we get Ollie to do it. Because it's ridiculous, we can only do bits of songs like Happy Birthday to Lorraine, we could only sing for like that amount of time. Right, um, oh, excuse me, I've got a sneeze coming. I'm so sorry, we've finally got any of these left, but I want to bring them to you because it's last of stock and therefore you need to be aware that they're almost all gone. Now, if you've not yet got this, oh my goodness, what have you been doing? They're mega, 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 mega. Okay, so this is a matrix box that includes gemstones, beads, sil metallic beads, and findings. It's a corker, absolute corker. Don't you think this would be perfect if you got the knitting spool today? Yeah, that'd be great. Because you could add those to, <clears throat> to the wire as you go down. Yeah, and um, all flip through. Fabulous, yeah. This is a perfect one for knitting spool. Okay, so I can smell something really nice. Is it you, Wolford? I think it's Debbie. Have you just spray perfume? Oh, it takes away the smell of my eggs and salmon that I had in here this morning. <laughs> it smells like drain, doesn't it? Sorry. 
<laughs> right, back to beauty. <laughs> oh, I do love it being classy. Right. The gemstones you've got. Are onyx and agate four millimeters in size black and white sorry black and clear they have gone through a dyeing process which is why you're seeing D at the bottom of your screen but D means dyed then you've also got the pink and the purple then I said hello, yep, I love you, I love this bracelet. <laughs> I don't know why I'm, oh. blood sugars obviously no, need to go home. <laughs> now that bracelet that all of you have been loving, you get all the beads to do that and obviously you get the gold ones as well because this is the same as we had in the other matrix box. And how many of you find silver to be your favourite colour of findings? Well, you're going to get a silver findings box. Debbie, can you just check out this plastic for me, please, so you can store polymer clay in it? Yes, you'd be fine. Thank you. You can store polymer clay in the main box as well. So not these little ones, but this one, you can store your polymer clay in. And then... These are your findings. Now the findings are fab. Really, really, really fab. You've got these gorgeous charms of which you've got leaves and, uh, and hearts, shepherd hooks, big balls, smaller balls, chain, lobster claw clasps. Why is everyone laughing? Toggle clasp behave. Debbie Bulford, you filthy, filthy minded lady. I didn't start anything. Uh, right. So you've got your findings, got all your gemstones, you've got those gorgeous metallic beads as well. What was that, sorry? Keep them still, I know I'm crashing them around all over the shop, aren't I? Free phone number 0800 644 You get all of the storage you can see as well. Just 34.95, you've got the equivalent of strands and strands and strands of beads there. Fabulous carrot weight, you've got your frosted um, brass beads in there, of which you've got the rose gold colour the yellow gold colour, the gunmetal grey and the silver colour. Free phone number 0800 644 655. And now we've got our last Matrix box off the show. And I love it. Now, it's only ever been seen on The Late Show before. You've never had the chance. So if you perhaps only have access to Freeview um, and you only ever watch the show during Freeview hours, you will not have had the chance to buy this before. So I know, I'm pretty certain this is going to sell out. Now, it has got some elements in here that you could use for Kumi Hemo, but you don't have to. Now, I love this for storage as well, because let's face it, as jewelry makers, storage is quite a big issue. Now, don't, you won't be able to use this for, your, for storing your polymer clay. This box will not be appropriate for storing your polymer clay. Debbie is just shaking her head like, no, it's not. I'm, are you proud of me, Debbie, for knowing that? Yeah, I'm learning, I'm learning. So, they look at this. It is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Now, all of the findings you're seeing, you're going to be getting in their individ own individual little cases. And you get one, two, three, four, five, yeah, 20, 20 pots. Okay, so for example, look at all of these. Now, how much would it cost you just for this in a bead shop? doubles up as a little shaker <laughs> you've then got these gorgeous charms in there look you've got your hearts your stars and your moons lobster claw clasps um jump rings yes they're saw cut jump rings so if you want to do any chain mail technique can i just say i think these are really really useful size they're lovely look at the size hole in them let me just get my where are my tweezers where have i put my tweezers mike did you steal my tweezers uh no you didn't i don't you didn't that's that okay great have a look at these no, oh thank you darling and it's my actual tweezers my tweezers they are fab look at the size hole you'd be able to get that's at least three millimeter hole there aren't they gorgeous right this is flying out we're gonna have to be uber quick in terms of your kumihimo um aspects 
you could actually totally use this with the knitting spool as well because if you're doing braiding even though it says for kumihimo where the ends let me show these look once you've done your braid or oh, missing one here but don't worry this is just the demo one you will be getting obviously two of that size you will be getting two of these this always makes me think of a little doll's house and that i'm going to reveal dinner hello scott you've had a haircut they are beautiful aren't they so basically all you'd need to do is you just glue your braid into there okay now also lending itself to braiding and kumihimo there's so many aspects of this i just thought i'd quickly show you these ones these are for attaching charms so you can put a big thick braid going through there and then dangle your charm right we're going to sell out of this one a free phone number 0800 644 5 and this is just 27.95 giving you 530 pieces how good is that how good is that free phone number 0800 644 5 now we have just got a few of the knitting spool left in stock we've got a five prong and we've got a three prong um, I actually only have the three here. The five one is over with um, with Janet. That'd be great, thank you. Do people sing Rocky Horror to you all the time with your name being Janet? <laughs> not normally, no. Do they not? <laughs> no. All oh, right, cool. I've just had a song from Rocky Horror Show going through my head because one of the characters are called is called Janet. Janet. I have an Auntie Janet, and I just sing it to her all the time. Um, they will know though obviously obviously yeah uh, right but you get two um, well you've got two options sorry it's your, your price is just for one in both of them you will be getting the appropriate size needle but it's not too sharp at all it's not too sharp so basically we had a demo on this earlier um, We're going to do the three pin first. We had a text in earlier from somebody that's saying that they'd found another one on a website for thirty pounds and ninety nine pence. Look at our price, twelve ninety five. You get the spool and you get the doobly doodle. Do we have an official name for the doobly doodle? The doobly doodle. The yeah. Um, what did I call it earlier? I can't remember. I called it a dowel, didn't I? But doweling. Thingy. Dowel. I don't know whether that's the right term for it. I'm just seeing if it's. No, there is no official name for it. I'm sure that it has. It has got one. Um, Twelve pounds and ninety-five pence. It's got a hole in the centre. Your three peg um, will give you a slightly slimmer finish than your five peg and you'll notice with your five peg as well you've got a big much bigger hole i would say if you're only going to be buying one i'd get the five because the hole's bigger did you want to Maybe. see the, the effect of the five yeah please i didn't realize you oh i did just a little section i couldn't do much but you can see how open it is with compared, all compared ribbon. to that one Look at, thank you so much that one's so got this a bit is, in the middle but this is with the three three peg and this is with the five peg and that's with organza ribbon. How fab is that? So the three peg is using the uh, orange satin cord and the five peg is the organza ribbon. Thank you so much for that, Janet. That's ace. 12.95 on those. Right, which did you say to go to next, hun? Have we seriously got some left? Right, if you've only just joined us, I really didn't expect us to have any left. Massive, massive, massive quantity of this initially. Where's it gone? Just waiting for Amelia to get me the offer, thank you. I would like these ones, thank you, because these are 925 sterling silver. Right, trade price on these. Trade price. Trade price on this, which has been our biggest seller of the whole day. We worked out with what you're looking at here. You have got the equivalent of 24 inches of chain. 2.4 meters of 95 sterling silver nine carat rose gold plated um, wire if you were to look at it in terms if you're making your own rosary chain is the way i was thinking about it you'd be using head pins so head pin to head pin gives you 2.4 meters amazing 
you've got eight pairs of shepherd hooks you'll have um, 40 crimp beads 40 crimp bead covers four times that 60 head pins yeah giving you 2.4 meters you've got the four lobster claw clasps you've got four toggle clasps you've got eight pairs of shepherd hooks you've got 12 jump rings you've got 16 um, four rose gold, what's that then hmm what's that four for no oh sorry ignore me uh, that was a uh, different detailing uh, you've got seven oh it's seven inches on that chain so 28 inches 28 inches of the 925 sterling silver with nine carat rose gold overlay this is and oh, what's well, rose gold plating it is incredible incredible that gives you an essence um, obviously I've given you the quantities you get masses and masses and masses but that gives you an example of at least one of each element in there all of your crimp bead covers as well they are amazing trade price and at staff cost we could not get this anywhere near what you're getting it's amazing 40 pounds for the lot 925 sterling silver nine carat rose gold trade price a trade offer you don't have to wait for one of our trade shows to get this deal right here right now at kjgc94 0800 655 just staggeringly fabulous okay we have actually got a copper version as well uh, as in it's not a copper version because it's a different findings pack but we appreciate that's not going to be in the price budget for everybody we also appreciate that not all of your jewelry is appropriate to use your 925 sterling silver some of it perfect for using the copper and it's copper plate this is actually um copper plated now it's plated with rose gold color um and you've got 114 findings in a meter of chain it says 115 pieces 115 finds 114 findings in a meter of chain we've got this on offer at just 14.95 for 230 pieces 230 pieces for 14.95 so you're going to be getting 30 flat head pins 30 of the finer head pins ball head pins 30 of the thicker ball head pins and these are measuring at least five me uh, five centimeters each two pairs of the slim shepherd hooks i'm only showing you one of everything you're going to get double all of this two meters of that beautiful chain let me show you this chain because it is just stunning it is really stunning and chains with pendants goodness me it's just so in fashion at the moment you're going to get two meters of that amazing chain then you'll be getting 30 crimp beads, sorry, 40 crimp beads, 30 crimp bead covers, two of these incredible toggle clasps, which are just gorgeous, two of these gorgeous connectors, two of these, look, look, this is masses, two of these uh, toggle clasps, 20 of the rope finish jump rings, four pairs of this style of shepherd hook, 30 of the saw cut jump rings and six of the ribbon cord ends with the S hook. 14.95, amazing. We're gonna go over to Janet and see what she's been up to with her challenge kit today. Could you bring my uh, bracelet? Could I bring you your bracelet? Yeah. So <laughs> I've got to pick it all the way up from there and take <coughs> it all the way over here. Hello, 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 hello. What an amazing, oh, oh, love, 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 love. So the kit that you're seeing on your screen, more than a 50% saving. If you were to buy it tomorrow morning, it'd be 51 pounds and 10 pence. So Janet, talk us through what you've been up to with this kit, with all that organza ribbon. Oh. Um, I didn't get to use hardly any of the organza ribbon I, I wanted to do something with the um hardly got a chance to use any of the kit because i've been gas banging away to you the whole show but uh it, it's so lovely and all the different colors so i use the purple because you you know when you put it next to the stones you get the purple off it mm. you put the blue next to them you get the blue from it all the colors of ribbon you'll find those colors within this stone that's fab well, so yeah. it's just gonna work yeah everything that's so fab. 
I love the fact you put the toggle clasp at the front as well. Yeah. That's just gorge, gorge, gorge. And then here, the blue's really being drawn out, proving exactly what Janet's just said. So the colour of the organza that you choose to use will really ha Look, look, how blue does that look there? That's so cool. And then these fab, funky earrings. So I could have chosen any colour from that, the ribbon and it would have had the same effect. Amazing. It brought out the colour. And then look at that. You see, pyrite, I think I've always sort of typically gravitated towards using gold colour findings with it. But with it being the rainbow fi finishing on it, that really looks amazing. And those proportions. Look at just the attention to detail on that as well. Look what Janet's done. All of this will be photographed and put up onto our website and our Facebook page as well. Gorgeous. And then using the five prong knitting spool, we get this really thick braid using the organza. And I will be using that more now. Now, now I've actually got into it, uh, I'll definitely be using the actual it more. spool. The spool, yeah. Fabulous. So twenty four ninety five, and then there's a piece that you're just working on. There. I was just going to do just a simple threaded um, piece, yeah, because I just think those together, those different shapes together, just look beautiful. They really do. They really do. Same gemstone, different size, different shape, and they just really, really work. There you go. And that's just simply just threading them on, clasp on either end, and it's fab. done. Job done. Really, really, really fab. I've just had a little bit of a heads up talking about fab. We've just seen what Debbie's done. It's a chainmail show. I tell you, today between <laughs> Janet and Debbie, you're just going to be like, totally. Now, just talking about, mm, in all seriousness, for just a moment, we are about to leave you on Freeview. Please do join us. You can watch us live on YouTube. You can go to jewelrymaker.com and you can continue to watch uh, on the internet. Obviously, if you're watching on any other uh, version of TV, Sky or Virgin, etc., continue to stay exactly where you are. Before we do anything else though, and before we pass over to Jenny and her team, we've got a few of the emerald strands remaining. And they are just incredible. It's completely natural, Brazilian emerald, and I think it is mind-bogglingly incredible quality. And it is just 47.95, very limited stock. We only had 100 of those to begin with. Just got a few remaining on 0800 644 six double five wow 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 bearing in mind of course they are may's birthstone so don't go anywhere continue to add to your order remember it is only one post and packaging price all day the prices that you've seen in the show today are still available until nine o'clock tomorrow morning so do continue to add to your order um, when the prices will change at nine tomorrow morning but debbie bulford is up next with the fabulous well fabulous debbie bulford she's up with jenny at least you got one good bit. But on ah, ha, ha, ha. I love her. I don't go anywhere. She's here with her supermarket outfit on, ready for you to take you through for the next four hours. With Debbie Morphe, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Thank you, Janet. Your race. Bye. <laughs> Get involved with Jewelry Maker by sending the studio a message during our live hours. You can send a text to 60777 and start your message with JM Studio or alternatively go to our website and click on watch the live show, simply type your message into the box and press send. Make sure you stay tuned in case your message is read out. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Hi everyone, it's Steve, Alan, Phil, Jake and the gang here near the North Pole. We're coming at 89 degrees, 15 minutes, 15 seconds. Just gone midday on Saturday. Uh, not good visibility today, uh, going tough. Uh, ice has broken up a lot, but still pushing on hard, team in good spirit. And uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing you all in the sunny, warm UK in about 10 days' time. I hope less. Speak to you soon. Bye.